What's going on, guys? It's your boy, Worthy Prince, coming at ya with another Lord's mobile live stream. Let's go. <laughs> How we doing, chat? What we doing? How we doing? Do you have a good weekend? A good week? I haven't streamed for a few days. I've been busy editing. Hope you don't mind. Let's bring you up on the stream. There you go, chat. Let's bring you in. There you go. What's up, chat? How we doing today? We're feeling good today, guys. Oh, yes. <laughs> So today I, I was I woke up late and I was getting ready to do some editing and I was like, okay, let's see what the day brings. Uh, we're gonna make some more videos today, some more shorts. I was gonna do a little bit of a stream later on, but guess what? We got an earlier stream today because IGG coming through with the new update today. Well, I say new update. It's not really an update as such on the game. It's more of just a, an add-on. That they've added on. I'm sure all of you guys already are well aware of what they have added on. So today we're going to take a look at the new Jade Worm Army skill that's just come out. Now they brought the Hell Drider out recently, and I wasn't completely sold on the Hell Drider. I've mentioned that a few times. I think it definitely has got a place in Wonder Wars, but it's very situational. It's very situational. It's good against some things, not good against others. It's not like a game changer. However, today's one with the Jade Worm could potentially be a game changer because it's, they've literally put an army skill on the most expensive pay to play familiar in the game. So it's going to be interesting to see what it is. We're going to get into it in just a moment. Before we get there though, I just want to say hi everyone. Welcome to the stream. Hey, what's up Kraken? I see you there. What's up dude? <laughs> hey, what's up peeps? I hope you're doing well. Hey, well, let's see who was first today. We've got Rayan Cartoon coming in first. Eco Roberts, Cotton J, what's up? Lord Poison, we've got Unsof Unlove Solo, we've got Dino in the house, Nightwall Atom, good morning, Ravi, Maestro, Danny, what's up, Kent, Uo, Zahid, Joji in the house, my baby Dobby house elf has arrived, what's up bro, Maresh, what's up Iggy, how you doing, hi Brienne, hi Shahid, hi Bugsy, hi Arnav, Sparta, Arsene, what's up, Good morning, everyone. Hi, hi. Good morning. If I didn't say your name, it doesn't matter because I still love you. Thanks for coming through. <laughs> Thanks for coming through and hanging out. Okay, guys. So today we're going to dive into it and we're going to take a look at this new army skill. Without further ado, let's dive into the game and see what's up. We're also going to have Corinthians on the stream with us as well today, doing some testing with us with the camps. So we're going to bring Corinthians into the stream as we get into the game as well. He's on, he's on Discord with me right now, or on Lineup, on the call with me right now. So we're going to have him on the stream with us today. So the most no, one, very knowledgeable person. Uh, so we'll see how we go with that. And uh, <laughs> I always like having guys on my stream. It's always fun having peeps on the stream. So yeah, good stuff. Guys, are you ready? Are we going to do some testing? First of all, we're going to go and unlock the familiar and we're going to max it out. Yes, we're going to max out the familiar live on stream. And then we're going to go ahead and do some testing. So I think I'm ready to get into this. I think you guys are too. So without further ado, don't forget to smash that like button, guys. Let's get the likes up. Let's get the likes generated. Let's let YouTube know we are here and we are live and we are ready to rock and roll. So let's smash that like button and get that up to 100 plus as soon as possible. Because that definitely needs to be done. So smash that like button, guys. Absolutely destroy it. And let's get into the stream. So first of all, let's dive into the game. Let's go, 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 go. All right. Yo, I missed you too, Zahid. Thank you, man. Yo, Corinthians, what's up, my dude? Not too much. How you doing, bro? All right? Yeah, I'm doing good. Good, man. So thank you for helping out with the camps today. I'm going to go and uh, unlock the familiar first, and then we can do the camps. All right? All right. Yeah, sounds good. Okay, cool. Um, as you can see, guys, we're going to be doing it on the Mortal Kraken account as well. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's on Kraken. <laughs> yeah, I ain't got enough orbs. I've got like 800. I ain't got enough to max it out. Otherwise, I would have done it on my account, but I don't have enough. Kraken, on the other hand, does have enough. So <laughs> we're going to be taking the Mortal Kraken account for a spin. Ah. <laughs> what mischief can we get up to, guys? What mischief can we get up to? Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to dive into the familiars. Let's go in. And before anyone asks, no, you can't have any gems. Just letting you know before anyone asks. All right. <laughs> okay, Prince, the new Divine update is good because it means unlimited kills. Okay, well, don't tell me anything yet. I don't want to know. I'm going to do my own kind of like 
review of it. But I appreciate that, Hazel. Um, crack an overview. No, 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 no. No crack an overview. Okay. So let's get into the familiars. What an overview is Monster Gear. We could, yeah, we'll do, we'll do an overview of his Monster Gear. There you go. You can, as, you can, as you can see, his Monster Gear is pretty good. There you go. You got an overview of his Monster Gear. <laughs> Rally my account. No, I'm good, thanks, man. I'll take a pass on that. I'll, I'll pass. Um, okay, let's dive into this. We're going to dive into the Jade Worm. This is the new skill. Now, this familiar itself is full on pay to play. I mean, to get this to level 60, you've got to buy the Jade Worm packs in the store. And then you got, you know what I mean? So it's not it's not easy to get this thing to level 60. You can't just forge packs to make this. Look, hey, yo, uh, Corinthians, make sure you turn my stream down, bro, if you're watching the stream, because I'm getting yep, feedback. Yep, yep. Thanks, buddy. Yep. <laughs> um, it's okay. He's new to this. It's all right. Um, so, yeah, basically, you have to... You have to basically buy the packs. You can't just use your familiar gear. You can't forge this. This is a pure pay to play familiar. So to get this to 60 is a chore in itself. And then they've added an army talent on top. So I can only imagine the army talent they put on Jade Worm is going to be good. Like I I always said the Jade Worm one is going to be banging. It's got to be. So I'm excited. I am a little bit excited. It's 160 gems or 160 brilliant orbs to unlock this thing. Which means it's going to be 1600 to max it out. It's normally times 10. Whatever it is to unlock, times 10 is normally what it takes to max it out. So, should be about 1600 to do it. We will count it up as we go along. I am going to get my trusty calculator out because I've just woken up and I can't be bothered to do math. So, I'll be adding it up on my calculator. <laughs> as we go along, we're going to start with 160. We'll check out the skill once I've opened it up. All right, so let's go ahead. With the first 160, we're going to gem the first one here. The talent is now open. Okay, great. So we spent 160 to get level 1. We're now going to spend 72 to get level 1 to level 2. There it is. And then it's 86 to go to the next level. There we go. Level 3. That's 100 to level 4. Plus. 100 plus 114 to level 5. So plus 114. Um, there we go. Plus 129. Plus 129. Plus 144. Plus. 188. 246. Gets quite expensive now. 246. Plus 361. I love the last one. So plus 361 equals 1600. Yeah, there you go. I told you. 1600. I was right. Yeah, so 1600 exactly. No, I know it's times 10. I'm just, I'm just like to, you know... I know you look at chat just because you know i i want to make sure so i'm just i'm just double checking so 16 <laughs> 1600 it is indeed 1600 it's times 10 i figured it was so this is some crazy slow math of a cat yo bro look i just woke up allow it yeah jeez <laughs> so look, anyway i'm just i'm typing it in with the cat with the mouse i'm not doing it with my fingers if i had a calculator in my hand i'd do it quicker wouldn't i yo are you guys judging the maths i just I'm just making sure, you know. I can't. No, it, it, what, what, look, moving on. Anyway, so look, level two. <laughs> Kevin can't be, but look, forget the fact. Oh, he's leveling up the familiar. It's so exciting. Well done, Prince. You're doing it for Kraken. That's cool. No, I'm getting dissed about my math. Like, seriously? Come on now. It's early. I'm tired. Allow it. All right, so <laughs> moving forward. No, 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 no. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, look, you know, why does the chat always... You know, Corinthians, I'm seriously considering minimizing chat. What do you think about this? <laughs> should, we minim should we minimize chat? Why has chat always got to pick on me? I, I, just, I, yeah. just might, I just might minimize it. Just, just, we'll just do our thing and they can watch, you know. Should, should we minimize? Well, well, I can sub in for the chat. You can sub in for the chat. Me and you would just chat. I just <laughs> yeah, minimize I can chat. Pick on you. Yeah. Chat, I'm getting close to closing you down. I'm just, I'm just saying. All right, anyway, so. <laughs> All right, so, <laughs> so. Anyway, level 10. Let's take a look at it. Okay. 
now I'm getting picked on for saying minimizing chat. Like, this is, what the hell? What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean bluff? Okay. All right, let's check it out. So look, this is what it does. This is what it does. It reduces, it reduces the, okay, reduces damage inflicted by enemies by 9% when 4% of your troops have fallen. That's actually, I mean, I don't know. Is that good? I mean, it sounds good. I mean, like, it definitely sounds like you could use this on your wall. 4% of your troops is not that much, which means this could probably proc on a defense on your castle for sure. 4%, that's really low. How good is this? And there's not a time limit here either. This isn't like, oh, it reduces damage inflicted by enemies for 9% for like 10 seconds or 5 seconds or 15 seconds. This is for the whole fight. That's actually pretty mad. It's for the whole fight. It does cost more than Hell Drider, so it's got to be good, right? Well, maybe. We'll see. But from what I can see, though, that's pretty mad. Like, the fact that this thing does reduce damage for the whole match after 4% of, of your troops are taken out. It's pretty badass. It sound, I mean, it sounds good. What's up, Sticks? How you doing, man? Um, He has to block us because he can't do math. It's not right. I can do math. I was just putting in a calculator because I couldn't be asked to, you know, in case I got sidetracked and started talking, I would lost where I was. I was just, you know, anyway, I'm not, I'm not, we're still talking about the, guys, are we really still talking about the math? I'm trying to go through the skill with the familiar and we're, and we're still talking about the math. Come, come on, man. Come on, what are we doing, chat? What are we doing, chat? Seriously. Um. Okay, so... 9% when the 4% of troops fall. It, 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 it sounds good. Divine Fire. I like the look of it. It looks good. Potentially, it could be good. I mean, let's, let's take a look at it and see what's up. So, we need to do some camp tests. Okay. So, we're going to do some camp tests, see what it's like. Because it's all good looking at the stats. But until we do some testing, we don't know. So, look. What I'm going to do today, guys, is I am not going to be using heroes. I am not going to be using gear. I am not going to be using any of that stuff because we don't need to. We just want to check the familiar power. We want to see if it's better or worse than other familiars in battle. So we're gonna, just similar to how I've done the Hell Drider testing. The Hell Drider testing I've done worked out pretty good. It gave me a good idea of how that works. And to this day, it's literally, my, my opinion hasn't changed on it. So and actually seeing people using it in fights and stuff, Emperor and stuff, really kind of reinforced the testing I've done on the Hell Drider. So... My testing was pretty accurate last time, so I'm going to roll with the same kind of testing scenario this time so, as well. Okay, so Corinthians, Mr. Corinthians, I am going to start with we're going to do a, we're going to do a Griffin versus Griffin versus Worm, to see what actually performs better. So, what do you I want am, me to go? Ten k, five k, ten k? No, no, no. We'll start off with spears, like we always do. We'll start off with spears, and then we'll move into mix. How's that sound? That sound alright? Yep, that, that yep. sounds fine, but what right, do you cool. want me to send? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what I want you to send. I want you to put 10,000 tier 2 infantry down. Oh, okay. That was really Oop. quick. Let me recall. <laughs> uh, that will be too quick. <laughs> yeah, 10,000 tier 2 infantry down. No, he doesn't need a lead. You don't need a lead to do this. Okay, so... 10,000 tier 2 infantry and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to send uh I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to send a tr troop march that you're going to you're going to count on me on to ensure that my troops proc okay my familiar's proc yep. so we're going to scout the uh camp take a look there we go 10,000 tier 2 glads excellent so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to attack this with a griffin there you go. Put the Griffin in. And I'm going to attack it with 10,000 tier 2 range. So we're going to get countered here pretty hard. Which put myself in range. What, what formation are you in? Can you put yourself in infantry foul, please, bro? Okay. One in second. Infantry foul, yeah. Yep. Good All right, sweet. No, and the war demon tier 2 do not act. Oh, God, here we go. I knew someone was going to start on me this morning with this. Tier 2 act differently. Tier no, they don't, bro. I'm sorry, but I 150 million percent disagree with you on that. So, I mean, if you want to believe that, that's okay. It doesn't. It's the same. Okay. Sorry, I just... <laughs> I can't be dealing with that today. 
It's uh, Fury's fine because Corinthians has got Fury as well, so it's okay. How can you test without Fury? With all right, you know what? Chat's driving me mad today, man. I can't. I just can't deal with chat today. I'm just gonna do the. You know what? I'm gonna do the testing, and I'm just gonna let the chat chat watch because I can't deal with chat today. It's literally driving me mad already. All right. So I'm gonna send tier. I'm gonna send ten thousand tier to range at you. Yep. Like it's almost like chat thinks I don't know what I'm doing. Like, come on, man. How long have I played this game? Seriously. Like, guys, come on. Are we really gonna go there today with the, with this? It's driving me mad already. Oh, okay. Chop, chop, March. No, I'm just not. <laughs> I'm just not looking at it. I'm just gonna do what I'm. I'm just gonna do my thing. All right. So it's ten thousand tier two range. You're getting your ten thousand tier two infantry. My my troops are gonna prop. We're gonna see what happens. So let's go. First, is that second camp the same as the first one? Yeah. Fantastic. Okay, let me just quickly. Right, I lost. Perfect. That means I definitely proc. Okay, good. And then we're gonna do the same thing over here with ten thousand range, and we're gonna use the new Jade Worm. Sweet. Let's go ahead and hit. Right, we lost, but that's fine because I'm getting countered. I want to lose. I just want to see the difference in the loss. That's fine. Okay, great. So let's have a look. First report. Oh, that's you. Okay, I don't, I don't say nothing yet. Hold on. <laughs> okay, so first one I went in, I lost 7,204 troops. He only lost 420. Obviously, that did proc. Just to make sure it proc. Let's have a look. It obviously did, but let's just take a look. Right now, we're just testing it on spears. So right now, it's just spear testing. So there you go, there's the griffin coming in, giving me that extra 200% army attack for that 10, is it 10 seconds? Yeah, 10 seconds. So for 10 seconds, we're getting 200% extra army attack from the griffin. That now has finished, and we're back down to our original attack. And then, okay, great. So you know the rest of the result on that. So 7204, 420. Now let's look at the Jade Worm. Okay, yeah, kind of what I expected. I mean, we killed 376 compared to 420, which makes sense because the Jade Worm doesn't add any attack. So we're actually losing attack damage. But look how much less troops we lost. 6652 compared to 7204. Wow, I actually saved a lot of troops, man. That yeah that's huge that's, that's huge. huge bro that's huge okay that's actually pretty badass mate wow that's gonna be uh, so for spears it might not be, i mean you might get more walkbacks from your spears for a certain if you're using a spear definite man it's definitely gonna save your troops a lot but like it, your damage output's not gonna be quite as much just because that griffin's not there but we're gonna test it with full sets of familiars shortly as well that's what it looks like all right well, that's actually quite mad. 6652 compared to 7204. Damn, man. That's actually pretty mad. All right. So what I'm going to do now is we don't really need to do any uh, spears again because clearly that works out all right, to be honest. We're going to do some mixes. So four, four. yeah, if we do a um, we do a 424. So if you do like 10-5-10. Yeah, 10-5-10. With no familiars. Just 10-5-10. Standard troops. Put yourself in range foul, bro. Yeah. Alright, 10-5-10 range foul. I'm also going to go range foul as well. Okay. Um, and I'm just going to do a two. We're basically going to do... Uh, this test will be the, the equal, like two, the, basically the same on the same, all right? Yep. What did you do? 10, 5, 10? Yep, 10, 5, 10. All right, sweet. Oh. Okay, so <coughs> on this first test, I'm going to do this as I would normally do, like a 4 2 4 setup. So it would be, for me, how I would normally do it, it would be the three main 11ks and then i would probably put a bunny in and griffin that would be how i would normally have my i guess 424 setup done 
Yo, thanks for the sub, Cab G. Welcome to the Worthy Nights, bud. This is going to be our baseline test based on what we already do. So this is like your standard 424 kind of familiar setup. Go ahead and hit that. All right, we're cool huh? Look at this. All right, so that right there is a standard 424 versus 424 with the standard familiar lineup as we always know it or as we always have it i mean there are some variables some people don't use bunny as their fourth they use like frostwing but for the most part that's pretty much standard how we do a 424 these days now we're going to switch out that extra pay to play uh sorry we're gonna do the, we're gonna, first of all we're going to switch out griffin and then we're going to switch out the second the bunny basically the, the fourth pay to play level five fam so if you can put that 424 down again for us please mate Yep. You could put uh, do two camps for me, like just one next to each other. All right, great. So let's go in and attack this one, and we're gonna do ten, five, ten, and again, we're gonna go with those main three familiars. And we will go with the bunny again, but instead of Griffin this time, we're going to go with the Jade Worm. So what we're doing here is just replacing Griffin with Jade Worm on this one. All right, we won again. And then we're going to attack the second camp. But this time we're going to put Griffin back. So let's do the next one. And we're going to go 10. Five, ten, and on the familiars this time we're going to go with the main three, which is Blackwing, Garg, and Bond. We're going to take out the bunny this time and go with the uh, Jade Worm, and we're going to go with Griffin. All right, let's try this out. All right, sweet. So we won again. Okay, let's have a look at these reports. So this was the standard one. This is just standard ones. This is the one with the standard familiars as we have it right now. We lost 6,890. We beat, we, we, we killed 8,907. All right, let's take a look at, and again, this is the same comp. This is the same comp, both in range foul. 424 versus 424. So there's no counters going on in composition here. It's just straight up 424 versus 424. Alright. 89076. Okay, let's have a look at it when we took the Griffin out. Okay, so that is with the Griffin taken out and the new Jade Worm familiar in. So we lost 6448 in comparison to 6809 so the, the, the again the jade worm made us lose less troops 8455 was the damage and again we had slightly lower output on damage because by reduced by taking the griffin away we lost that 200 percent army attack for 10 seconds and therefore our damage output has reduced um by a little bit but we did save a lot of troops like 6890 to 6448 is quite a significant amount we still got the victory but we saved a lot more troops when it comes to wonder wars i think that's quite a big thing you know that's quite a, that's quite a huge thing if you if you take a hit and you win but you end up with more troops in your fault you're potentially in a better position to take a second hit so this is actually really good i mean it's not bad at all let's have a look at the we took the this is the one we took the bunny out Oh my goodness gracious me. 6083 losses compared to. Oh my god. We actually lost way less. And we done 9644. Oh my god. Okay, that's fucking lit. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. So that's that's badass. Holy shit. That's 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 the 
Holy shit, Corinthians. That's fucking... Are you seeing this? Yeah, I'm looking, man. <laughs> oh, baby, baby. That's... that. You know, this is the, this is the big... You know what? It kind of makes sense. It kind of makes sense. When you're doing a mixed march, you put a range in, you put a cav in, you put an inf in, you put the griffin in because you want that army attack for 10 seconds. 200%. It's huge. But then what do you do with the fifth familiar? Do you put infantry in? Do you put range in? Do you put cav in? It's like, um... It's kind of like confusing sometimes. Like, do I put inf? Do I put cav? Do I put range? I don't know. This kind of solves that problem, maybe, by the looks of it, because, like, the, the, that, that full familiar slot now, Jade Worm. I lost less. I'd done way more damage. Let's do some more testing. But that that was actually legit. That was actually legit right there. Uh, let's save those three battle reports. Spear, spears, I, I mean, spears are spears. I mean, it'll probably still do good in a spear anyway. But that is just, again, if you're just joining the stream right now, check it out. This is the original set. So this is where you would... Let's go to the battle report. Like when you send like a 424, for example, like what I'm saying is you put your Bond, your, your Black Queen, your Gargan, you've got your, your Inf, your Ranger Cav, and then you go for your Griffin because you want that army attack. But then that, that Bunny is the questionable one. Why go Infantry? You could also go Cav. You could also go Range. Some people do go Cav. Some people decide to put two Range Familiars in there, but it's always variable. This this solves that problem. Don't put the, don't put the uh, Bunny in or the or the frost swing or the bee instead put jade worm in and you get a better result because this is this is the standard result 6890 losses 8907 kills and then with the jade worm instead of the bunny we lost 800 troops left that's massive in the if you put that into the perspective of a rally that's huge and then we've done way more damage 9644 let's look at the battle check out the battle my goodness gracious, that now now I'm getting excited because I'm seeing a significant change there. That that's pretty cool. Let's have a look. Crimfins, what we'll do now is we'll set up a counter and we'll see how it performs on a counter. Because if the if the jade if the jade worm actually saves you from losing on a counter, then that that's huge. Okay, so I'll put in a 992 and well, I was thinking, um, I was you thinking about put a zero five five against it. No, I was thinking maybe I'll go, you put zero five five down and I'll, I'll go, I'll go eight five, I'll go four two four because that is your, your, your zero five five should smash my four two four. Um, interesting, <laughs> interesting. Okay, let's have a look. Let's have a look. So, what, what we got down in the camps right now. Uh, two four two. Two four what? Uh, have a look. Oh, they're four two fours. Okay. Actually, yeah, um, sure. actually, leave the four two fours down for a sec. Leave the four two fours down for a sec. I just want to try something. So let's have a look at this. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna count him quickly. So these are two four two four camps. Perfect. All right. Let's count him and see if we do more damage with the um. If we don't, if we do more damage with the Jade Wormen or not on a zero five five attacking someone, so let's go with this first of all. So first of all, I'll send a zero five five like it's always sent. So what we'll do is I'll go. Well, first of all, we've got to change our formation. Uh, zero five five is sent in in that infantry wedge. Yeah, yeah, zero five five is an infantry wedge. Um. So we'll go like that and we will send our troop comp like this. So what we'll do is we will go. Hmm. I need to put 25,000 troops in. Um, I'll just put like 500 buffers in here. Uh, or or a thousand. A thousand buffers there. Oh. And then I'll go. Uh, so 10, we 12. 12. 1200 and 1200 all right yeah there you go that's gonna be my 055 my tiny little bit of uh in fact we can probably lower that even more 500 12 250 12 250 i can't do math yeah, it's all good <laughs> So, all right, so this is this is basically my 055 setup um, in Inf Wedge. And then we're going to 
set it. I'm going to send it like I would normally send a 055. So we're going to go range. We're going to go uh, range familiars. We're going to go cav familiars, uh, which are, where's the other one? Crosswing. So range cav. And then of course, Griffin, right? Yeah, Griffin. That's, that's how I would do a 055 normally. Like that. Okay. So let's go ahead and launch this. This should win. It's a full, it's a full counter to, to, to 424. So let's go ahead and do it. Yeah. So let's recall that camp. And this, again, this stuff, that's a full counter. It just goes to show you how devastating it is when you hit someone with 055 and they've got 424 in there or a low range comp. Absolutely decimates it. 055 is by far legit <laughs> when it comes to hitting out people with that kind of like low range heavy inf cav comp there you go you can see it right there devastation but how much more or less devastation do we get if we change up the familiars so can you put another 424 camp down for me please mate i already I'm, did it's yeah, there, man. yeah put another one in the middle between the two of us i'm gonna hit this one on the right and i'm gonna do another test as well so let's go ahead and get the let's do this troops first so we're going to go 500, 12250, 12250. There's our 055 setup. And then familiars. This time, what we're going to do is we're going to go range. We're going to go cav. And we're going to go with the Jade Worm. So again, we're taking Griffin out. Although it seems like taking Griffin out is bad. Like Griffin doesn't want to come out. Griffin is actually pretty solid. <laughs> so we, we don't... It, it seems like Griffin always performs pretty well but we're going to try it without griffin and then i'm going to take out one of the pay to play level five fams and see if that makes a difference let's go ahead and send this in and see what happens and this is with the jade worm replacing griffin okay boom there we go so let's take a look at this and it's kind of as I expected. We done more less damage. We lost less troops. We lost three thousand six hundred and six. So we lost a couple of hundred less troops, but our damage output was dropped significantly from nine thousand six hundred down to eight thousand nine hundred. So clearly, if you're attacking, you're going to want that Griffin in there. Makes sense. So I'm going to do one more test here. Let's just make sure this is a this is a four two four camp, right? We're going to do another test with me countering him. And I'm going to, this time, take out one of the pack fives and put the, put the Jade Worm in. So let's go ahead and attack. And we're going to go with the 500, 12, 250, 12, 250. And this time around, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go ahead and leave the cavalry familiars in. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave. Um... Oh shit! I left them on the I left them on the tile, didn't I? <laughs> you donut! Bring the familiars off the tile. Okay, five hundred. Let's do this again quickly. Twelve, five hundred. Twelve, five hundred. All right, sweet. So we're gonna leave the cavalry familiars on there. I'm gonna put the 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 black queen in, but I'm gonna leave the B out this time we'll leave the b out and i'm gonna go ahead in fact you know what i might do it the other way actually i might go with black queen b gargantua worm and griffin so we're taking out the frost wing the frost wings what we're taking out but we're leaving the range familiars in all right let's try this out see what happens here Right, okay, let's take a look at this. Okay, pull back here. Oh yeah, pull back my camp. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Cheers, mate. <laughs> Interesting. So three thousand six hundred and six in comparison to Yo, it's exactly the same. Three thousand six hundred and six. We lost exactly the same amount. And we done eight nine nine three in comparison to eight nine one five. No, sorry, nine. This is the original one, isn't it? Yeah, nine, nine six five seven. So we've done less damage again. 
a lot less damage. But three. Hang on. That's the wrong one. Wait, so. Hang on a second. Eight one. nine nine three versus eight nine one five. Yeah, this is the one. This, this that's the original. Okay, yeah. At three eight eight seven. Three six oh six. So again, we lost the same amount of troops, 36606, by taking out the Griffin or taking out the Pack 5 fam. But we 8915, 8993, we ended up doing a bit more damage. But overall, we actually got a better result, to be honest, by just going with the standard setup without Jade Worm. So if you're, if you're attacking with a 055, based on these results, you're always going to be wanting to hit something that's low range comp. So putting the 424 in there kind of works really well. Um, based on these results, you're probably going to be, I would say, in fact, there's one more test we need to do. We need to take one of the, um, I'd done it just now by taking out one of, I took out the Griffin there. I took out the Frostwing here. Let's do it and take out the B. Put another 424 camp down, mate. Let's do it and take out the B and try it without the B. Well, I'm out of T2. I hope I don't get rallied. <laughs> oh no, he's out of T2. Don't rally him. <laughs> like, yeah, oh no. <laughs> um, okay. 250. Roll 500. 12,500. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to take out the B. So I'm going to go Garg, Frostwing, Blackwing, Worm, and Griffin. So this time we're leaving the two Cav fams in, but we're taking out the B. Hang on, no, my, 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 my thing's wrong. 250, there we go. There we go. There we go. Mm, donut. All right, 500, 12, 250. So there we go, 25,000. Did I put too many troops in the last one? I'll check in a sec. That's that's right. Yeah. All right, let me send this. All right. Did I have more troops in the last ones? Yeah, you sent 500 more troops. Oh, my bad. On the last march. Yeah, my bad. Oops. No, don't worry about Send it. Send it right. again, then. Yeah, what was that? That was from where I placed the replace the Frostwing, wasn't it? Yeah. Alright, let me delete that report. Let me do, put another camp out. I'll send it again without the Frostwing. Okay, one second. There you go. All right. So I'm gonna go Blackwing B, Gog, Worm, and Griffin. 500, 12, 250, 12, 250. That's perfect. All right, there we go. There's not the, the 500 extra's not there now. All right, cool. Let's have a look then. So. Two reports gone in, two hits gone in. Both ones without the B, ones without the frost wings. So this one here is without the Griffin. I think we can we can uh, we can remove this one because the Griffin. I shall leave it in there for the moment. But this is the one with the Griffin replaced with Jade Worm. And as you can see, compared to the standard setup as we have, we have done way less damage. Well, way less damage. Three six oh six. We saved about 250 troops, but we've done way less damage. Let's have a look at the one with without the bees with the bee switched out. Okay. 8954. Again, less damage, but less troops lost. And it's probably gonna be the same, I would imagine, for this one, alright? Ooh. Very close. Yeah, that weren't bad, was it? That's actually quite a nice little report that. So taking the bumblebee no, taking the frost swing out and putting the jade worm in actually worked out really well hmm that's actually not bad at all 
Okay, so I just want to try one more, mate, if you don't mind. Okay. Now, this is just a random one I'm chucking in there. I just want to see how it does. I, I still think that this is the best one we got by switching out the frost wing for the Jade Worm on the 055, right? This this definitely this definitely gave us a, a good result. But is it better than the original result is what, I'm, is what I'm thinking. This is the standard setup. You lose 3887, you kill 9657. That's 600 more troops killed. I still think... The standard setup is probably better if you're gonna if you're gonna do a zero five five, you probably are better off having the two range fams, the two cav fams, and the griffin because you're you're doing way more damage when you attack. You want to do as much damage as possible, so I still think this is probably the better option. I think Jade Worm is solid and definitely makes you lose less troops, but the damage output just ain't there. And when you're attacking with a zero five five to knock someone out of a fort, you want that damage output. So. I would probably stick with the standard on a 055 attack, but I just want to try one other variable just very quickly, just to see. I'm pretty sure this is going to be shit, but let me just quickly just check this out. I'm going to go with the same thing. I'm going to remove the frost wing. So I'm going to go black wing. I'm going to go uh, black wing and dog, B, Jade, and Griffin. So we're removing the, the frost wing again. Oh, wait, no, sorry, no, sorry. I'm going to take out the. Um, the B, <laughs> and I'm gonna put I'm gonna put Helldrider in, mm, and Griffin. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna take out the B and the and the Frostwing now, and I'm gonna put in Helldrider and Worm with Griffin and the two, and then the two pack five fams, the Garg and the Range. I'm gonna see how this works, how this looks. So let's try this out with these. So. Let's go for yeah, 500, 12, 250, 12, 250. Let's try this out and see how this looks. Because the Hell Drider was good also saving you troops. So, and the J Worm does that as well. So let's have a look. I'm just curious how this performs. <laughs> Okay, so we killed 8,616 and we lost 3,586. So, as suspected, you see, look, we, we lost 3,607 on the last one. It made us save troops. Hell dry to help us save some troops. But. Hmm. Where's the standard one gone? 3,887 in comparison. It's a couple of hundred true. It's, it's not a massive difference. The damage output is way bigger with the original settings. With the original familiar setup, 9,657 versus 8,616. Yeah, it's like a thousand difference. So, okay. Let me delete those reports. Uh, you can remove that camp, bro. Um, yeah, it's your camp, bud. Oh, is that my camp? Sorry. Okay. <laughs> so what we're gonna do now is okay so based okay so interesting interesting so what i would like you to do now is i am going to put a 4244 down and i would like you to set up a 208 on your troops so i think for a 208 if we're doing twenty five thousand troops i think you should put twenty thousand as cav um 5,000 as inf, and then obviously a, a little bit of buffer. Like, just make sure you have 25,000 troops total. Obviously, you're going to be going in um, range wedge for a 208. So maybe just put like I did on that last one, like just 500 range buffers, and then most of it in in cav, and then you, 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 you know you work out. You, you know what you're doing. Um, I'm going to put myself into a range file, and I'm going to sit in 424. So the this camp here, this 424 camp here is going to be 10,000 imp, 5,000 range, 10,000 cav. And the first test we're going to do is going to be the standard cookie cutter kind of like defense you would take. So we're going to go with uh, the three main familiars, the black wing, the garg, and also uh, the holy terror. 
Um, we need to choose a level, another, another familiar here. So I'm going to go ahead and choose a bunny. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and put um, Griffin. There you go. So that's a standard black cookie cutter setup for a 424 style or variant march. All right. Let's pop that on the uh, on the tile. Oh no, Terry, pull your tile off, bro. I want I want you to attack me. Think it'll matter? Oh, it doesn't really matter, does it? Same thing, no. same thing. Oh, you just got to set it up again. That's all right. <laughs> Hang on, thank, thank you so much. Um, all right, give me a second. You're such a douche. <laughs> Right. I can't make it easy for you all the time. No, I know, bro. I know, I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, so 10, 5, 10. So we're going to go and march this in. This is just standard. I should lose this. I should get smashed here. Because this uh, the 208 is the counter. Yeah. No, oh, double one. He's, he's just that strong, isn't he? <laughs> okay, let's have a look at this. Yo, what, well, dude? Why did I? You had twenty six thousand for a stop. Why did I smash you so hard with that? Because I got the familiars, I guess, right? Oh, you're gonna need to put your familiars in here. Oh, I don't do or do you? No, that shouldn't matter. A bit. That shouldn't matter that much. That's a that's a huge counter. Damn. Well, I don't know. Maybe he's just that strong. His range stats are just that high. <laughs> Holy shit, bro! That that. Bounced hard. That bad. That actually bounced seriously hard. Wait a minute. You need to increase the inf a little bit. Yeah, that, what Leroy just said that as well. Yeah, do five k imp. Do five k imp. Do nineteen thousand five hundred cav and five hundred sharpshooters. Can you do that for me? So yeah, 5,000 imp, 19,500 cav, and 500 sharpshooters. Prince formations on point like DA, I know, right? <laughs> okay, are we, are we good? Have you got All that? Right, yeah, yeah, you got that, yeah? Let's have a look. That's better. That's better for a 208. All right, let me hit it again. Let me hit it again. That was yeah, cause that that you bounced hard off that one. I, you shouldldn't have bounced off that. Okay, so let's go for that sh that, that standard one again. So there we go. Bunny and Griffin, and then we're gonna go with the standard four two four. So ten, ten, five, ten. Okay, let's send that in again. You, you you're fully countering me here. I won again. How? Doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Lot Kraken's a beast. Kraken's a beast. That's all it is. Okay, his range stats are too high. Okay, it's fine. So, like, okay, fine. Let's just roll with this for the moment. So, okay, so 4298 is my losses, and your losses are 838603. Okay. Now we'll do it. Put, put, another, put another camp down. And I'll do it with um, the Jade Worm now. See how the Jade Worm performs. Uh, what do you want me to go? Yeah, I know the familiars like... make a difference. Yeah, do you want to put familiars? Do you want to put some... Yeah, let's, let's try it. I was thinking that as well, guys. Do you want to put some familiars in your march, bro? Uh, nah. Five, what was it? 5,500 and... No, I mean, what I'm saying is I'm, I'm winning so heavily because of my familiar damage. You need to have that familiar damage firing back at me. So can you can you do me if can you set, send the same comp you just done? So yep. do do five hundred um range, uh, nineteen thousand five hundred cav, and five thousand imp, but also put in your two hundred eight familiar your two hundred eight familiars that you use. So you put oh, in you put shit. in your garg your frost swing you know you, you, your usual stuff that you would use like your your goblin. Um, I think. I don't know whether you do what I do, and let's put one level one infantry fam in there as well. I normally chuck a Bon Appetit in there as well when I do a 208. But whatever you do, do your 208. Normally maximum cav. 
Yeah, one second here. And then that way you've got that, that familiar damage coming back at me. Wait, let's have a look at this. Right, there we go. So that's that that is literally how I do mine. Okay, perfect. That's great. Right, let's do that rest test, do that test again then. So I'm gonna do the standard standard test first. So we're gonna go with um Gog and Blackwing and Ho the Hotera. And we're also gonna go with uh, Bunny and Alwyn. And then we're going to go 10,500, 10,000. Okay, let's try this again now. This time you've got that calf damage coming at me as well. So, and I lose. There we go. So that familiar damage is helping you. That's, that's, that's more realistic. Great. Can you pull that camp out and put exactly the same camp down, please, mate? Yeah, that's better. There you go. That's now that's but that's more. Oh, hang on a minute. You've only got twenty thousand five hundred troops. You've only got twenty thousand. The comp, the comps, the comps wrong. Ah oh, shit. Wait, wait a minute. Oh, my comps wrong. Fuck. Okay, put the camp down, man. <laughs> you gotta love test. Who had the idea of doing this first thing when I wake up, man? Seriously. Put, <laughs> right, put that put that down again, mate. I'm sorry. You you done everything right. You done everything right. It's me that done it wrong. Alright, one second here. Mm. Guard Griffin. Terror. Yeah, I need some coffee cracking. Tell me about it, bro. Your range stats no, are just what? too high, by the sound look of it, bro. It's, they keep bouncing him. Um, yeah, so you do what you did last time. So 500, 500 um, range, uh, 19,500 cav and 5,000 inf. And then you're going range wedge. All right. Let's hit it again. This time we do it properly, yeah? Yep. 10,000. Well, no, oh, no, you, no. You, you haven't said that yet. <laughs> me, yeah, me, me. I know. It's me doing it right. Okay, there we go. That's better. There we go. 45,000 troops. Woo, woo, woo. Okay. Um, Holy Terror, Bunny, and that. No, not that. That. Okay. Right. Sending it in. See what I have to and put up with chat? Really? I mean... <laughs> I won again. I don't, I, don't, I don't understand how he's winning this, but it's super, super close. I think it's just coming down to base stats here. I think in an actual rally situation, there is something I would like to do very quickly, if you don't mind, just to prove a point that was made right at the start of this stream. Let's just... Let's just if you could do me a favor, could you just put that 25k troops out again? But this time, can you do it? Can you, can you use tier four for me? Tier four for me, please. Sure. Thank you. Uh, so same familiars, everything the same, just tier four troops. Because there was a comment made right at the start that tier four behave different to tier two, which I I dis I, I don't think that's right. I think like, it doesn't matter what tier all it is, it's just extra damage. You're just increasing stats. It's the same result. We're gonna just test that theory right now. While we're here. And then we'll come, right. and then we'll come back and we'll do a we'll do a tier two test with the Jade Worm. So, 500, 5,000. So that's our first test with 208 versus 424 on standard comp. So let's just get rid of everything else. I just need this right now. We'll come back and do the, another test tonight in a sec. So what was that? What am I sending? Like 500? Yeah, so 500 tier 4 range. 
19,500 tier 4 cav and 5,000 tier 4 infantry. Excellent. All right, let's let's let's, let's go. Scouted. Is your familiars in there as well? Yeah. I think so. Yep. I think I got them right. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. All right. So now we're gonna do a tier four hit just to show you that what I'm trying to say. Like this is the this is the basically this hit we're about to do is the equivalent of this, but this was with tier two. So as far as I'm concerned, all we're really gonna see here is just higher might losses. There's not gonna be no real difference in the actual battle. And I'm just 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 just, just gonna try and prove a point here. So, again, I'm going to go in with my 10,000, 5,000, 10,000. And we're going to go ahead and put those standard familiars in again. There you go. So, again, look, no change. All same familiars, same comp. Only difference is we're using tier 4 instead of tier 2. March it in. It's going to walk slower. That's that's one thing that's going to happen. It's going to walk a lot slower. And I actually lost there. Okay, let's have a look. Okay, well, okay, maybe there's there's the diff. Maybe there is a difference. <laughs> maybe there is a difference. I don't know. I mean, not a lot, but I mean, not a lot. Like, there's not a lot in it. That is basically the same, isn't it? Yeah, it's close. <laughs> it's cl I mean, look, it's close enough. It's close enough. It's 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 there and thereabouts. They don't behave differently. It's it's RNG, man. It's RNG on the familiars. Let's do it again. Do it again. Put it down again. Is that, a, is that your camp again with tier four in it? Well, you that's the one you hit, but I just want to hit and bounce off of it. Yeah. Yeah. All right, pull that back and put it down again. I want to do it again. I'm not eating my words. Put it down again. It's RNG, bro. It's RNG. Um, I'm telling you, I'm telling you there's no difference between using tier two and tier four. It's just RNG. I'm not wrong on it. I know I'm not. I'm telling you now, guys, I'm not wrong on it. It's the same. It's just RNG when the familiar's proc, etc. cetera, blah, -de blah. There's no difference to, to it at all. Oh shit, I sent it without familiars. One second. Wait, are you are you in Fury? Uh no. Get Fury, bro. Hey, trying to boost my stats up, huh? <laughs> no, no, you had Fury last time. You had Fury I, I last time. Kraken's God, I promise. No, no, no. You didn't, you didn't have Fury last time, so it's cool. It's cool. <laughs> Test without familiars. What tier? What tier four versus tier two? Bird frost, griffin, booby, holy terror. All right, good to go. All right, is that a tier four march? Exactly the same, yeah. Yeah. All right, cool. Oh, no, not Harris. Please. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, I lost again. See what I mean? It's different again. Different result again. 9,400, 6,876. That other one was 8,100, 7,743. There's no change. I'm not changing any. Basically, they see these two reports? It's RNG, guys. These two reports here, these two defeats, they're identical. They're identical attacks. 10, 5, 10, 5, 500, 19, 500. They are identical attacks with identical familiars but with two different results. How can you measure anything when you're getting two different results off 
exactly the same march. There's no change. Oh, okay. Yeah, if he had Fury. Okay, he had Fury that time. Okay, so he had Fury. So therefore, I took more damage. He took less. Okay, Fury. It's the Fury then. All right. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Let's do it with tier two again, please, bro. Now you've got Fury. Can you put it down with tier two? Exactly the same march with tier two. So what I've got here is the tier two hit. And then there's the tier four hit. Okay. And the tier four hit, if, if I'm being honest, is behaving more like it should behave. I should lose. I should I should hit a 208 and lose. But this is this is correct. This is how I would expect it to behave. I lost by a lot as well. So that's right. That's how it should work on a four. For some reason, the tier two march didn't come out like that. And maybe it was because Fury weren't activated. So if your Fury's activated, let's put the tier twos down with the same familiars and let's do the tier two retest. It should bounce. It shouldn't win. I should bounce. So there you go. That's the tier two set up. Exactly the same. He's in fury. I'm not. So 10,000. 5,000. 10,000. And then we're going to go with the, the familiars. There. All right. Send. It should bounce. It needs to bounce. It bounces. Oh. Okay, it bounces. How much did it lose by? There you go. Oh. Ask and you shall receive. Oh my god. Finally, I can actually prove my point. For fuck's sake. Like, now I will prove my point. Are you ready, chat? I'm going to prove my point. It's coming. <laughs> Losing my shit, I swear to God today. <laughs> there is the tier four hit. Tier four. I'll say it loud in case anyone misheard me. Tier four. There's tier four. Okay, tier four. Four two four going into 208. As you can see, I lost 9,440, 6,876. Now, if I go to tier two, tier two, 9,475, which is literally like the same as the tier two. And oh, look, he lost 6894. And on tier four, he lost 6876. It's pretty much the same as the tier four here. It doesn't matter whether you use tier four or tier two. You are going to get the same, the same, the same, the same results. So anybody that comes in here and tells me, ah, tier four behaves different than tier two. Stop flapping your gums. Just listen and learn. I'm telling you, I, I know what I'm doing. Just needed to just prove that point, man. Because come on, I know what I'm doing. Uh, it's just. Oof. No, I'm losing well, my. Some, I, days I'm, he does. some days, chat. Some days. <laughs> I, I miss he does. Literally uh, losing my mind today. I'm literally <laughs> losing my mind today with with with, with comments. Ah, oh, I know best. I know best. No, you don't. Just sit down and watch and learn. Like it's just, it just. Oh my goodness gracious! Like it's the same. Now we've established that tier two and tier four doesn't matter whether you use the either or the all. I said, you know, fuck it. Let's use just tier five and use the white lunite up. How about that? Because tier five behaved different to tier twos. You know, it doesn't matter. You can use tier one. It don't matter. It's just more damage. Fell night. Thank you for the two dollar donation. You should try with tier three. Yeah, yeah. Cheers, bro. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay, right. But where were we? I've deleted all my reports because I'm a fucking idiot. Oh, hang on a minute. No, I haven't deleted all my reports. We're back to tier two. All right, Corinthians. Yeah. I have the report in front of me for me hitting two hundred eight with my four two four two four, and I've got it in tier in tier two. Where's the tier two report? Get this tier four report out of my face. I want the tier two report. That no, this is the tier four one. Be gone, tier four report. Okay, tier two report. Here it is. Could you please put on the camp the two hundred eight comp of five thousand tier two glads. 500 tier 2 sharpshooters and 19,500 tier 2 cav in a range wedge and please ensure you have fury you can scout me after you've done it make sure you got your yeah. familiars in there as well the same way you had it set up this time chat i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to hit the four to hit the 208 again but this time i'm going to replace the bunny familiar we're going to replace this bunny familiar 
with the new Jade Worm Familiar. That's what we're going to do next, okay? God, give me strength. Please, God, give me strength. Okay. Right, there we go. Perfect. Beautiful. Beautiful. I love it. Thank you so much. Okay, here we go. So we're going to attack the camp. This time we're going to go in again with the 424. We're getting countered on this. Corinthians has fury, yeah? Yeah. Yep. Smashing. All right, so we're going to go with the standard three familiars everyone uses. Bon Appetit, Gargantua, and Blackwing. Uh, we're going to switch out the, bu the bunny, like I said. We're going to switch out the bunny for the worm. And we're going to go with the Griffin. Griffin just seems to be just some badass familiar that you just have to have in. It has to be there. So here we go. So there we go. That's a nice little setup. Let's go in and see this. Let's compare the damage now between that. Do we get a walk back or do we win? That's the first question. Okay, we lose. So the worm doesn't save us. The worm doesn't come in and say, yo, I'm actually going to make you not, not lose. You're still going to lose. But how much did we lose by? Okay, so 8037 in comparison to... 9475. That's pretty huge straight off the bat. Straight off the bat, we lost we lost less, like 1400 less troops using worm. But I'm guessing our damage output was dropped. So with the with the with the with the uh, bunny, we've done 6894. With the worm, we've done 6530. So again, it doesn't if you get countered, you're still gonna lose. But you are gonna lose less troops if you've got the worm in there, which is good, I guess. Um, but you are going to do a little bit less damage to your enemy. But overall, the amount you save is quite significant, I feel. Um, it's definitely quite significant. I wanted, I'd wanted, i like to do that test again and take out the Griffin this time and put the Helldrider in, if you don't mind, bro. Yep. Let me, let me, oh, you've already got the camp down. Lovely. Did I put my familiars in? No, you didn't. You need to recall that and pop your familiars in there for me, please, buddy. Shay scoof. So the whole point I'm getting at here with this is... If you put your Wonder March into a into a fort, okay, and you're using the three main attacking the pack fives, the Blackwing, the Garg, and the Bon, but you've also got Helldrider and and now Worm in there as well. Yo, what's up, Guru? Thank you for the 14 month support. What's up? I'm doing good, man. Just stressing out over testing, but I'm doing good, bro. Thank you. What's gonna happen, I think, is if you get if you if, so, if someone rallies you and you counter them, you're gonna win. And you're actually going to have more troops saved in the fort. If someone hits you like for like, potentially you're going to win as well and have more troops left in the fort. But if someone counters you, you might not win, but you're definitely not going to lose as many troops. That's not, a, that's not a bad thing, right? It's actually pretty good. Let me go ahead and hit this one more time. And I'll show you what I mean. So, Garg, uh, this one, that one. Then we go for Helldrider and... Helldrider and Worm with the three attack familiars like this is what I'm talking about. I know our damage output is going to be dropped now because we took Griffin out, but it's not about that. It's about protecting ourselves from nasty ca nasty counters, right? That's what I'm getting at here. How well does that protect me from nasty counters is what I'm getting at. So let's go for 10,000, 5,000, 10,000. Have a little sneeze. And we'll go ahead and send that in. I expect to lose way less troops with this, to be perfectly honest. We lost. We expect to lose. We're being countered. There's no reason why we should win if we're being countered, right? If they brought a familiar out that stopped you from losing when you get countered, that'll just be broken. So we expect to lose. We did lose. 7,901 losses. Wait, 7,901. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? Look, 8037, 9475. We're actually losing less troops to a counter. Down to 7901. Now, of course, our damage output, 6148 in comparison to 6530 with the Griffin in. Like I said, our damage output has reduced, but and this is the big but. 
we are losing less troops on the counter. We're okay. and, we're, and, we're, and we're still going to be able to defeat counters ourselves. Like if someone sends me a march against my 424 and it's I, and I counter them, I'm going to actually still beat them. For example, I'll show you an example. Um, let me get this camp off. Oh, take that camp away, bro. For example, and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Let's just let's go occupy uh, 10,000. 10,000, 5,000. See, now I've now I've got now I've got a 424 right here. I've got a little bit of 424 situation going on, right? So let's say I do a 424 like that. And I go ahead and I use the main the main three familiars again. Look, Imp. Uh Imp. Uh what am I doing? Black wing, so Imp range. And you know, we stick Cav in there as well. Screw it. Put the put the garg in there as well. I know it's the lowest. Attack stat on a 4442, but put it in there as well. Cav's still important. Give the Cav some love. And we put these two familiars in, like these two. Yeah. Okay, great. So that's basically going to be my march, right? Put that down. I know it's 442. I'm putting 442 down on purpose. Um, now, if you can hit me with, like, uh, what would be. I guess, yeah, if you, if you come at me now with that, with that 208. I'm gonna stay in my range file. If you if you attack me with that 208 you tried a second ago, because now I've changed my comp up, I've got a lot more range in here. It should you shouldn't be able to push me out with a 208 with that much range. One second, my troops are set. Get some. Familiars what about the, what about other here. stats that you you get only when hitting the wonder? Yeah, I mean like all them stats are gonna do is just increase the attack damage. So you're gonna. You're gonna. It's, it's basically gonna be a, the same result, but on higher numbers. Basically, the more attack, like you can keep, you can keep pumping up attack and pumping up attack on 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 it. Obviously, there's loads of variables like who's who's got more HP, who hasn't, etc. There's loads of other things that come into it. I mean, these are these are the best. The, the best. This is the best basic way I can test this. Now you can see there. I can still. I can still defend. I can still. He, he just attacked me with 208. If we take a look at this, boom. I can still defend myself really nicely against counters. Like, I, or if someone tries to attack me and I've got the counter, I can still I can still defend if someone sends a troop at me and I counter them. I'm still going to get a really good defense. I might not kill as many troops of theirs because if I'd have had the Griffin in here, if I'd have had the other pack fives, they would have hit me and they would have lost more troops. But then so would I. And then my fault, my my wonder is then my my wonder is then left with less troops. It, 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 I hope you guys are trying to get getting what I'm saying. If I have the Griffin and the other pack five in here, when he hits me with that 208, I would have done more damage, but I would have taken more losses, which means my fault that I'm sitting in has less troops in. And you ideally want your fault to have as many troops in as possible, especially if, you, if you're going to be defending potentially against the second hit. So... You don't quite do as much damage, but you hold on to more troops than you fault, is what I'm saying. And then, okay. if you do get countered, now send an infant. Send, send um. What's what's in here? I need to put one more march down. So if you can just um, sorry. Well, I'm gonna pull I'm, your march. I'm gonna put. Wait, don't. I, I just wanted to try one more thing for science. Before we do that, can I you just you... Hit, can you just hit me with an infantry blast quickly? Sure. Just, I just want to just, just just finish off this little bit of segment. Otherwise, I'm going to be all over the place. Um, yep. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go I'm gonna go uh, ten thousand ten thousand. I just need two infantry blasts off you just to make a point. So first of all, this is the comp we use the, the nine nine two comp, and we're gonna go with that same thing I just done a second ago. So boom boom boom, and then these two, yeah. So look, I'm putting that down. Let's say I've got my 99 with my 442 down. We know that 442 is susceptible to an infantry blast. Corinthians is going to with your familiars as well, bro. 20, 25,000 infantry and infantry front. So right, infantry foul, 25,000 inf, um, and infantry familiars, like, you know, the full infantry set. Um, so he's going to inf blast me. Now, obviously, if I'm sitting in a fort with 442 in range front, the last thing I want to do is take an infantry blast because it's going to wreck me. So I'm going to show you the damage that I would take 
if I got fully countered. And that is a full counter. If I'm sitting in a fort with 442 and I get hit with an infantry blast, I, I, it doesn't get much worse than that. <laughs> That's literally a full counter, right? So let's wait for him to send this infantry blast at me. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to redo the infantry blast test, but I'm going to show you what it would have done if I'd have not had Helldrider and Jade Worm in there. It certainly, uh, it certainly mitigates the losses for sure. How are we getting on, bro, with that infantry blast? Coming in one second here. Trying to find my... You remember, you're, you remember where the attack button is? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've already done some I've already done some spear test. Oh, you mean test it instead of the shield familiar? Yeah, we can do that. We can do that for sure. Right. And then that's that's a big ouch. Oh, oh! Well we lose. We lose. Look, bang! 12,291. Ooh, I told you, Inf Blast is gonna wreck that. But now let's have a look and see what it would have done if I had not have had Helldrider and Jade Worm in there. I mean we're we're kind of interested in what that would look like, right? So get, give me two seconds, Corinthians. Just put this back down. So that's your standard 992. And now we go with a standard 99 cookie cutter setup that everyone uses. So they normally go like, what do they do for 992? They normally go this, 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 this. I guess this. I've, I've not given the cav any love here, by the way. Just gone for infantry and range familiars and a griffin. A lot of people set their 992s up like that because they want their familiars firing off with the highest stats. So we'll go with that. Pop that down. All right, dude, come at me with that infantry blast again on that camp. And we'll see the damage it does this time. So again, this is me getting this is me getting fully countered with infantry blast onto. Oh, you make sure you're in. Just stay in range wedge, bro. You're in the wrong formation, but just stay in range wedge is fine. Yep, yep. Um, it, it, There would have been a slight difference if it had been an infantry foul. Probably would have took a bit more damage, but this will do for the test. It, it proves my point is what I'm, is what I'm getting at. So he lost 6624, I lost 12, 12, 2, 9, 1. Here comes the hit with them familiars. Obviously, I lost again. Now look at this. 13077 and 7635. So again, we've done more damage to him because we've got that extra griffin, that stuff in there. Um, but 13077 compared to 12291. So it's not a huge difference, but it is still a difference. We still lost uh, more troops with the other familiars so it's just you know that's just a point i wanted to make there um okay now send that same comp yeah but use uh hell rider and jade worm just, just for science i just did oh you used them both huh yeah use them both bro jade worm and hell rider yeah, I, I done that for the first hit. Was that when you hit me with? Uh, I deleted the uh, report. Yeah. I, delete, I deleted the report now. But the first, the first hit you done was with Hell Rider and Jade, and the second one was without either of them. Yeah. So yep. Yep. I, yeah, got it. Got, got it. it. All right. Cool. All right. So I think uh, before we get to the spear thing, I will do it in just, just a second because someone wants me to check out the shield familiar in comparison to it not using it. Um, just going back to the mixes. What we noticed, the big thing we noticed so far is 424 versus 424 taking out that fourth pack five familiar and going for the Jade Worm had a huge impact. Massive, massive difference. So let's go back to mixes for a sec. Let's go back to mixes for a sec. I'm going to put down um, an 857. Okay. So 857 would be i've got to work this out now you know i'll do it but i'll do it based on 100k because it's a lot easier to work or 200k it's a lot easier to work out so if i do 800 500 700 there you go that's that's actually that'll actually be better cool if you can send i'm gonna do 857 if you do 95 Nine five six. Nine five six. So what I want you to do, um, let me just get this familiar. Then I'll tell you how to set it up. I want you to do nine hundred yeah. inf, nine hundred tier two inf, nine hundred tier nine hundred tier two inf, 
500 tier 2 sharpshooters and 600 tier 2 cav. Let me get this march on the ground for this. Hold on. So my 857 march, the way I would normally have it set up would be... It would be cav, it would be inf, it would be range, funny, and tailwind. Right, there's my 857. Now, if you can hit me with 956... Um... And and your normal 956 familiars that you would use if you were doing a 956. And so it's 900, 900 tier 2 inf, 500 tier 2 range, 600 tier 2 cav, and then your 956 familiars. Now it'll be enough troops. It will it'll, it'll still give me the result I need. You don't need to use like thousands of troops. You can do it with just a few hundred. Like me and Booze were doing some testing last night using like 400 troops. You don't need to use a lot of troops. Okay, so that's the test. That's a straight up normal test. As you can see, he lost. Nine, that's 956 into 857. Okay, good. Let's do another test. Um, I'm going to pull my camp back. This time I'm going to put the Jade Worm in instead of the Bunny. All right. We're going to do exactly the same test. Occupy. Here we go. So nine. Oh, sorry, not nine. Eight. Five. Seven. And this time, I'm going to go with what I think is going to be the new meta. Yes, guys. I said the word meta. <laughs> I think this is going to be the new meta. Griffin. Boom. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Them three pack fives and boom. I put, I'm going to say it now. I think this is going to be the new meta for mixed rallies on Wonders. Not for 055. It doesn't work well for 055. You're better off going with your standard that you have for 055 and 208. I don't think, I don't think which our Jade Worm is going to benefit you much there. You want maximum attack when you're going in with 055 and 208 because the sole purpose of their marches is to knock out whatever's in the fort. So it's no good trying to min max and lose lose less troops. You want to fucking hit everything. You want to chuck everything. You literally want, basically, guys, you want to chuck the kitchen sink at the wonder when you're firing off a 055 or a 208. You want to destroy as many troops as possible. Okay. So the Jade Worm is really not going to come into that because there's other familiars you can use that boost your attack. However, for this, it's doing mixes on mixes, trying to hold against multiple rallies. I think this is going to be the new meta right here in front of me, what you're looking at right now. So let's go ahead and send this down. And we're going to really forgive it. If we're going to, it's already worked out great on the first test we've done on this. So now I want you to do 956 again for me, bro. 900, 500, 600 with your familiars that use the same ones you used a second ago. So, right, Master Nick, I will definitely be doing some chat requested ones in a moment, my dude. Um, if there's tests that you would like me to try in a little bit, I will get you to do it. Right, I'm expecting big things from this one. First of all, we didn't lose again, which is good. Okay, we held. Nice. Okay. Now, let's take a look at this. Right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He lost a 1,000. He lost 994 on that one. And on this one, we lost 698. It was close. 73. Yeah, it, it's better. It's better, baby. <laughs> Yo, it's actually better. It's it's actually better. That, 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 that was almost a counter formation you sent there, which is why it was quite close, because it was more of a more of a counter. Um, but yeah, no, it's definitely close. You, we, we, we widened the gap using the using the Jade Worm. The bunny didn't really do anything for us. It actually. Yeah, it's a better result. Okay. Nice. And if you saw earlier on the stream, we done 424 versus 424. When we'd done exactly the same comps, the Jade Worm made a huge difference. It was massive. It was night and day. Um, yeah, Jade Worm is actually pretty good. I like it. It's actually pretty good, man. Mm. Definitely, uh, definitely, definitely really interesting familiar. I think that's definitely going to be the new... 
the new meta there. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and do that, that, that spear testing that one someone wanted to check. So what I'm gonna, what I'd like you to do is, Corinthians, if you could please put down, uh, just put down 10,000, 10,000 tier two cav, but put your familiars in. So, All right. yeah, put your put your familiars in. Uh, 10,000 10, tier two cav with your familiars, just cav familiars. They, they, yeah, they, ITG never let us know. ITG never let us know. I think this is a good up. I think this is a really important familiar. I think this is definitely going to be in people's wonders. Um, for sure. Like, does it not make a difference on how the familiars proc based off army size? Well, no, not really. Because, like, if you look here, I've got, I'm running eight. I'm literally running eight, five, seven. So, don't forget, I may have less troops, but so is he. If you put two full wonder, wonder rallies in here, they're both going to proc at the same time. There's, there's no difference. There's no difference. It, it, there's no difference between hitting 2,000 and 2,000 to hitting 375,000 or 4 million, 4 million. You know, it's, it's, a, it's the same thing. Okay, so what's that down there? Is that Cav? Yeah. Oh great. Okay, there we go. Look. So we got 10 Oh, we got the Hell Rider in as well. We got 10,000 tier 2 cav on the floor. We're going to hit that with um infantry. Because that's what you do, right? You hit cav with infantry. <laughs> now we're going to hit it with infantry. Uh what we're going to do though is we're going to send 10,000 tier 2 imp. I need to make sure I'm in infantry file. Uh can you put yourself in cav file, please? Yep. Infantry file. And so we're putting both our troops right at the front, yeah? And let's go ahead and have a look at this. So 10,000 inf. And I'm going to go ahead and use the shield familiar first. So bunny, bon, uh, shielded familiar. And then we go with fear spike and griffin. That is what you use for an infantry blast at the moment, right? So let's go ahead and send that. We're going to lose this. Oof. Okay. As you can see, we got clapped. 8,343. Oof. 1289. That's, that's, that's what would happen right now as, as we have it. So what we're going to do now is we're going to do the same test, but we're going to change the shield familiar for the new worm and see if it makes a big difference or not. See if the shield fam does a better job. If you can put that cav cav camp down again for us, mate. Yeah, shield versus J. That's exactly what we're doing right now, bro. This is your shield. This is your shield report. Okay, with the shield fam. Gilded guard. Infantry going into cavalry because I want to make sure my familiar's proc. So I just want to see what does what saves me the most troops, basically. And, and also damage output is also important as well. Here we go. So the camp's down again. We're going to go 10,000 inf. And we're going to go with... Uh, yep. So Bon, Bunny. No shield familiar this time. We're going to go straight in with the Jade. And then we're going to go with uh, Griffin. And then the Stacker. Okay. All right. Let's have a look and see what happens here. We lost, which of course we will. But how much did we lose by is the question. Okay, 8,314 comparison to 8,343. Damage output 1289 compared to 1269. Okay. <laughs> so we lost slightly less troops, but we did a slightly less damage at the same time as well. 8343, 8314. We lost we lost like 30 less troops. 1269 in comparison to 1289. So we lost about 30 less troops using the Jade Worm. But we killed like 20 troops less. So at, at actually our damage output dropped ever so slightly. In my opinion, there's not really a huge difference based on that test, that single test. 
I would still go with Shield Familiar because it seems like we have more damage output. And when it comes to Spear Rallying, damage output is what you're looking for. Not necessarily saving troops. Damage output. So the Shield Familiar seems to come out on top. Is there anything else we can switch out to, to see if it's better in a Spear or not? I don't think it's even worth taking out Griffin. I just really don't think it is. But I'll tell you what I am interested in trying out. I'm interested in trying out... I mean, and again, you wouldn't take out the stacker. I mean, that's pretty huge, right? It's 100% extra attack every... Your damage output would drop significantly if you took this out of your spear. What about if we took the bunny out? Corinthians, can you put another camp down for me with that cabinet, please? Sure. Thank you, bro. Are you getting tired? <laughs> He's going to fall asleep on me in a minute. Uh, no. All right, no, good, no. good, good, good. Uh, let's have a look. If you got the familiars in there as well, dude. Oh, no, I didn't. Yeah, pop your, that's all right. Pop your familiars in. Put your familiars in, bro. And make sure you're in Fury as well. Yeah, I'm still in Fury for a little bit. Yo, thanks, Josh. Appreciate it, mate. Yeah, I don't think he was in Fury in that last hit as well. I know. It's okay. Uh, all right, 10k. And there you go. Scout me, bro. Oh, I'm in Fury. Oh, he's in Fury. Okay. Oh, was you in Fury for the last hit as well? Yep. yep. Oh, sweet. Okay, cool. I still got six minutes left on it. Oh, smashing. All right, cool. So what I'm going to do is I I'm going to do the same thing. Thing. I'm gonna go ahead and send, send 10,000 imp into him. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and leave the bunny out. I'm gonna go Holy Terror, Jade Worm. So basically, it's set up like a normal infantry blast, but I'm just not leaving. I'm just taking the bunny out. I wanna see what this does. Wait a minute, what? Okay, so holy shit. Look, <laughs> did you see that? The, 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 the damage output dropped significantly because the bunny does loads of damage. So yeah, you're, you're, you're damaged. But look how much less damage we took. 8,314, it went down to 6,688. That's actually mad. Like the, the, you, you actually, I mean, you still wouldn't do it because you would, you would, you would still get capped. If you, let's say, for example, you hit a rally trap or something, or you hit someone with a big troop comp, and you're going to get capped on, uh, you would get capped, and you still would, you still would, uh, you wouldn't do as much damage potentially, or you might even get a walk back maybe on when on something you wouldn't normally get a walk back on. I don't know, man. The damage output's way lower with, without the bunny in. I wouldn't, I wouldn't. I would not put the bunny in on an infantry blast. It's as simple as that. Okay. You can remove that cam there, bro. That's cool. Right. Um, okay, so let's just let's just recap. Let's just recap for a second. Okay, now I'm not using leaders. I don't need to use heroes. Heroes just increases the damage. It doesn't change the result. Okay. Um, let's just let's just um, let's just recap here for a second. So, 424 onto, let's talk 424 onto 424. If you, let me, let me, let me go to the uh, battalion screen here quickly, just to show you what I'm talking about. Okay, I just want to do a little bit of a recap, and then we can have a little talk about any other testing we need to do, okay? So, just to recap, if we go to the battalions, let me just pop in here and just clear this for a second. I'm not going to save it. Okay, so... On a standard 424 that you put into a fort, you would probably go something like this. You would go Garg, Holy Terror, um, Savage Breath. You would probably put like a net, and then you put like another pack five familiar in this fourth slot. You know, so there's been a lot of testing with what to do with this fourth slot. I mean, we definitely use Griffin. So what goes in the fifth slot? That is like a big question mark. And it's been a lot of testing. I mean, there's been all sorts of things tried over the over the time. Some people have tried using that. 
Some people have tried using this for the range front. You know, some people have tried using shield familiars like this on their range front. Like so, so much testing has gone on as to what is better, what is better. It seems like what is what the norm is. Most people just chuck another pack five fam in because it's reliable. Yeah, you can put a shield fam in, but it's very situational. Things become situational when you start using things like this. This might potentially give you a better result if you're in a range front because it's got a shield on it. But if you put this into your Wonder March in a fort and someone sees you've got Snow Beast in there, they're going to know you're sitting in a range front. So although you might get a better result using a shield familiar, in, you know, you are giving away what your front line is. So people don't like doing that. People like to use stuff that's reliable. Bunny is reliable. B is reliable. You know what you're going to get. It does what it says on the tin. So let's go with that. And this is the standard what most people use. Whether it be Bunny or B or whether it be Frostwing in that fifth slot. Most people go for that kind of setup. However, what we are seeing is if you're in 424, for example, and you get hit with another 424, so like for like, this Jade Worm is giving you a much better defense. You're killing more troops and you are saving more troops. I want to do that test again just to show everyone if you don't mind. You right with that? Yeah, sure. 424. Yes, yeah, so if you could put um, 424 down. This time, use familiars, yeah? So make sure your familiars are in there. Your 424 familiars. Okay, so second. with like the cookie cutter set of 424 familiars um and then just put down put down um 4000 uh, 4000 4, 4, 4, 2000 4000 so that'd be total of 10000 two troops i'm just gonna redo that test see if it if i'm right on that Appreciate you guys for being there, by the way, guys. I know I've seemed like I'm in a bit of a mood, but I'm trying to focus and concentrate. I'm not in a bad mood. I'm just trying to concentrate on what I'm doing. Um, thank you for being here, though, and going through this testing with us. Don't forget to smash that like button. Um, we're doing this to help you guys out, to help the community out, to try and, you know, work out if this is a good purchase or not, if this is worth getting, all right? This update just come out today. Obviously, people want to know if it's worth getting and how to use it. Where does it work well? I don't just want to make a five minute video chucking a few camps out. I want to make a really, that's why, that's why we do it live. We're trying to do it comprehensive and really get a good feel for what this is good for, where it works. Is it worth the purchase? We're trying to get all those info, those answer, questions answered for you today. It Just bear with us. It does take a little bit of jiggling around, especially live. So I do appreciate your you patience. Appreciate, appreciate your patience, guys. Thank you. Uh, pop yourself into range foul, mate. Yeah. We're going to do range foul and range foul. So I'm in range foul as well. Let's take a look at Corinthians' camp. Um, okay, great. So look, Inf, Inf, Cav, Cav. He's not going for a range fam. Interesting. Um, I would normally probably put Blackwing in instead of um, Frostwing, but that's how he does it. So that's cool. That's fine. Let's go ahead and... You never know what your enemy's going to have in the fall, right? This is what we've got. This is what we this is what we face. This is what's in front of us. So let's go ahead and attack it. So we're gonna go. Can you get Fury as well, please, mate? Uh yep. Um, let's go ahead and we are gonna go ahead and send 424 as well. So 4,000. 2,000. 4,000. Okay, there's our 424. Lovely. And we're going to go with the cookie cutter set. So I'm going to go with boom, boom, and boom. And we're going to go with bunny. And we're going to go with griffin. So that's my standard kind of like, I'm doing a 424. That's pretty much what I'm going to be having in there. I mean, I might switch the bunny out for the frost swing sometimes. But for the most part, that's basically what it's going to be. Let's go ahead and send it in. Standard 424 against 424. And we probably will win because Kraken's base stats are higher than Corinthians um, so that's and in fact we lose Corinthians is a beast confirmed um, so there we go <laughs> actually there you go so there you go that's pretty great well done Corinthians um, yo Kraken are you watching <laughs> uh, hey, hey. 
hey, no, 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 hang on. Let, let's try that exact same thing again. But I'll put the, I'll take, uh, I'll, I'll take Griffin out and I'll put that range familiar in. Well, that new one. No, no, no. Hang on. Just oh, you mean put, oh, you mean put the Blackwing in? Yeah. Yeah. Take out that Frostwing and put the Blackwing in instead. Yo, Crimpheus might have stumbled onto something. Four two four works better without a range fam. Who would have? Who would have? Who would have known? Yeah, difference in what he did with his fam. Yeah, he did, right? He took the he took that range fam out. I think it made a difference. Let's have a look. He's gonna put the same thing down, but he's gonna take out the um, Frostwing and he's gonna put the Blackwing in instead. Fell Knight never puts a range fam in his four two four either. Do you not even do that either? See, I love this because we're learning things as we're going along. I always put a Blackwing in. Yeah. I always put a Blackwing in. I no, you always want to reduce your range stats, dude. But I mean, I put a black wing. <laughs> I put a black wing in because, in case I need to switch out, I've got options. I have options if the black wings in there. Anyway, well, let's check this out. Hold on. So, what we got in there now? You don't either. Damn. Why am I the only one that puts black wing? Because <laughs> you're a dummy. That's what. <laughs> Yo, Corinthians, pull that back and change that up. You need to take. You need to take out the frost wing and put the griffin in. You got the you got the frost wing, the garg, the, and the and the two infantry familiars, and the and the black wing. I always have a griffin in. Take out the frost wing, and put the griffin in. Okay, one second. This is where everybody in the everybody in the chat now says, "I don't put a range. I don't put a range one." You see, why is it? Why have I always thought a black wing would? That's four two four. What about eight five seven? What about so 857? If you're, run, if you're running, if you're running, what? Which fams do you want me to have now? I want you to have uh, Bon, uh, Gog, yep. Blackwing, Gorg. Bunny, Blackwing. Bunny, and Griffin. Yo, but what about 857? Because in 857 you have more range, so surely you would want a Blackwing to back that up on 857, or because it's a 424 variant. Any 424 variant, don't use. Blackwing, yeah, yeah, Blackwing in 857. Yeah, see, I always put Blackwing in my 857. I always, yeah. You prefer 94, okay. Let's have a look at this. So we got that, okay, that's what I'm sending at him. So, okay, yeah, perfect, all right. So yeah, not having the Blackwing in on the 424 previously, actually done him a big favor, it worked out really well. Uh, let's go ahead and do, do that attack again. So 424, so 4,000, 2,000, 4,000. So now we're going to go like, oh, I just, I just want to do this. So we're like for like, you know, um, so let's go oh, that, 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 and that. Yeah. All right. So now we're like, we're like, we're like for like now. Let's uh, make sure. Wait, wait, wait. Recall, 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 recall. Something was wrong. I saw 25,000. I, I saw the wrong numbers. Hold on. Something was wrong. 4,000. 2,000. 4,000. Oh, I was looking at the army capacity. That's why. <laughs> Donut. Yo, Alakazam. Thank you for the five pound donation, man. Appreciate you, dude. Thank you so much, man. Um, Right. Gog, that, that. Bunny and... Uh, so this is like for like now. So I should win this or are we bouncing again? No, I win this this time. Okay, yeah. So like for like, I win. That's fine. I just want to do like for like for a minute. Can you put that same march down again for me, please, bro? Put that same march down again for me. And then we're going to do what the chat just said a second ago. We're going to do your 424 again with no range familiar, but I'm going to put the Jade Worm in and see if it makes a difference. But right now, let's just go with that same march you just done. So, um, Garg, Blackwing, Bon, Bunny, and Griffin with the 424. If you put that camp down for me, or 4,000, 2,000, 4,000. So this result here, okay. this result here, take a look at that chat. This result here, I lost 3,212. He lost 3,222. So it was really close, right? 
and that's literally identical setups with the standard like familiars yeah now watch and this you wanted black wing in that yeah 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 so black wing gog bon bunny and griffin okay great so now this is exactly the same setup we just hit this time hopefully this works out all right because earlier on it made a massive difference yeah that's the same what we're gonna do is i'm gonna send the same march or two or and on the familiars i'm not gonna put the bunny in i'm gonna go for the, what i think is gonna be the new meta so we're gonna go griffin we're gonna go gog bon blackwing and worm we're gonna send that now with the worm right so check it out yeah the hell drone is not reliable it's it's very situational I'm, I'm i'm not a massive fan i'm not a fan check this out right so then we're gonna hit with this only difference is i've taken out the bunny and i put in the jade worm let's have a look and we lose okay that that's not what i wanted to see that is not what i wanted to see damn different from the results i had earlier it really is why are the results different well because i had a different well the we familiars the are different for one the familiars are the same right the, the, the familiars this makes no sense we did this earlier like for like on 424 and the results were night and day and now I'm losing compared to winning. Well, it, it, but when we started early, I wasn't in Fury. Yeah, there is that. Um, so the, I'm getting the Fury stats. Yeah, use Griffin there. Use Griffin in the last one as well. See, Griffin. And on this one, Griffin. It. I I think it, why you why I was losing at the beginning is. I didn't do the Fury thing just like you were in Fury, but. So basically we took out the, we took out the, this first report is with the bunny. We took out the bunny. We we're with the bunny. We won just by 10. By taking out the bunny and putting in the Grill J Worm, we lost more troops. We lost like a hundred. And 10 more troops and as far as damage output goes 3106 compared to 3222 we we our damage output dropped significantly man that's confusing man it's, it's another hell drider all over again dude he didn't have fams earlier on yeah you're right he didn't have fams earlier on the earlier tests. That's, that's you're correct. He didn't put his familiars in on the earlier tests. It's not a right. It's not a good test if I'm going up against troops with no fams in, and I've got fams. Of course, it made a difference like that. Take Blackwing and you. Right, okay. This is what we're doing. Corinthians. Yep. Put down that same march again. You just done, but you use the Blackwing as well. You use the Blackwing. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna take my Blackwing out, but you. You do your thing. You put down that march. As you did it before, so Gog, Blackwing, Bon, um, Griffin, and, and and Bunny. So I just want you to put exactly the same camp down. Gog, Bon, Bunny, Griffin, Blackwing, and then the troop comp four thousand, two thousand, four thousand. If you pop that down again for me. Right, yep. we're, we're gonna hit it again, ch chat, and we're gonna go with 4,000, 2,000, 4,000. We're not gonna use the black wing though. We're gonna go with Inf. Um, hang on, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. The way I would normally do it, but without the black wing. So we're gonna go with Gog, that uh, Worm. Bunny and Griffin, yeah? So the only thing which I've got here that you would normally have in here is the is the is the frost wing, right? So 
See, is this what you're talking about? Like that, right? So let's have a look here. So taking out the black wing, going for this instead. Right, let's just try that. We lost again. Yeah, nah. 3378. We lost even more troops. It's the worst result for us yet. 3119 that 3199 damage. Yeah, nah. No good. No good. Put it put it down one more time, mate. Sorry, I'm gonna just go with what you done now. I'm gonna I'm gonna do your one just with the infant cav fams. As we already have it. As the meta is now, I guess. Yeah, I'm doing it, bro. I'm doing it. So, there we go. Camp's down. Let's have a quick look. Make sure it's all good. Make sure you're in Fury, bro. There we go. Yep. So that's that's, that's 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 the same camp again. This time I'm going to send it as Corinthians sent the first one. So we're going to go, and this is, I guess, the meta that people use for four two four, right? So four <laughs> two four, and what chat was saying is they tend to go infantry, infantry. Cav, Cav, and then a Griffin. So no range familiar in there at all. Let's go ahead and send that. And we win. Wow. So the Jade Worm didn't do shit. The Jade Worm actually made us lose. All these defeats we had was 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 us losing. The standard meta at the moment for four two four inf inf cav cav and uh, griffin definitely seems to uh, definitely seems to still be the case of what you want to be using. So where does the where where does the J worm go in? We don't need leads, Ben. We don't need leads, Ben. Heroes don't make no make, scroll up. Uh, what am I looking at, mate? Mike, use Bon, Garg, Griffin, Frostwing. Bon, Garg, Griffin, Frostwing, and Jade. Okay, put another camp down, please, bro. You got to pull yours. Oh, sorry, mate. The same camp as before, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me try this. Um... I'm not getting tired. I'm fine. I'm waking up. I'm just, I'm. Sh I, it's it's the same with any kind of experiments, tests. It's it's frustrating when you don't get the results that you're expecting. So I'm ju I'm just trying to cover all the angles to see where this is good or not. Okay. So what did you say you wanted to try, bro? Let's have a look. Um, use. Okay. Hang on. Sorry. Four. Two. Four. Use Bon Garg Griffin Frostwing and Jade. So the Cav familiar, okay. Right, going in. We lost. Damn, man. There's about a hundred difference. It's pretty close, but it's still a loss. Three three oh seven to three two oh eight. We still done more damage and less losses by doing it without the Jade Worm and going for two inf and two calves. So may you suggest something to me? Yeah, sure. Based on what we're seeing. 
it, it feels like the the jade worm isn't as cracked up as it's meant to be in there in here let's have a look let's have a look hold on the reason you don't put in put in put gear into it is because you start playing with variables yeah exactly and you don't you, you don't you don't you don't you don't use gear when you're doing fort tests you don't need to or, or heroes you don't need to you can do it with just tier two troops and camps and familiars it's fine the shield familiar on spears, the shield familiar gave a better result, so we're going to stick with the shield familiar on spears. Take out Griffin, use Frostwing. Talents don't matter because that's that comes into your... Oh, yeah, we're both in talents. Yeah, yeah, we're both in talents. Obviously, that affects your... That, that, that affects your red stats, your green stats, anyway. We're not using leads. Yeah, DVL, what was your suggestion? I'll have a look. Can you attack in cav foul into range foul? Well, cav foul on a 424 should be the counter. Devendra Prasad says noob. What? What are you going on about, bro? It's 35 plus 4672 minus 30 minus 22, 186 up times one. Yo. Dude, can we just put this guy in timeout? He's talking gibberish. Like, what the hell? Jeez, get that get that guy out of here. Stop flapping your gums with your bloody algebra. I don't want to look at that. Jesus Christ. I'm trying to work out if this familiar is good or not. This guy's coming in with bloody cross angles and square roots and all that bullshit. It says percentage of infect percentage of inf inf it says percentage of inflected damage by troops, heroes. Heroes add squad damage. So without heroes, damage is pretty low. So the impact from the Jade is low. Yeah, damage by troops, not heroes though, right? I mean, I can try it with heroes. If you, I, I honestly, like when I've done wonder, 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 ten, wonder, when I've done wonder testing before on camps, I've never needed to use heroes before. You know what I mean? Like increasing damage just increases the damage, increases the numbers, the output, but the result would remain the same. Because especially if the other person, because don't forget, it's not just me adding heroes, Corinthians add adds heroes as well. Both of us have an increased damage output, but the result generally speaking stays the same, which is why you don't need to use heroes when it comes to doing camp tests. But you know, look, I'm down to try it. I'm down to try it. Um, of course, down to try it. Uh, Reduce damage inflicted by enemies by 9%. And I guess heroes do do damage. So, okay, Corinthians. My dude, my bro. We're going to try it yep. with... We're going to try it with heroes, okay? Now, we're not going to use leads. So, put your lead in your shelter, bro. Okay. One target. Put your, put, your, put your lead in the shelter just for a minute. One troop. Um, we're not going to be using leads. Um, but we are going to use heroes. So, no, I can go into the hero screen. It's fine. Um, no, I can go into the hero screen. It's fine. I don't want to show off too much on Kraken's account, but I, 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 I can go in the hero screen. It's fine. I think. <laughs> no, I think, I think he'll be all right, guys. I think he'll be all right. It's a net. I don't think it's going to make a difference, to be perfectly honest with you guys. That's why I haven't used heroes. But you know what? I will do it just because you guys are asking. All right. Um. I know, guys. This people already saying in the chat that damage is damage. It doesn't. That we doesn't have hero or not. I know this. I know this, but. Let's just do it because then we ain't got to ask the question, what if? So, Corinthians, if you put down 424 as you've been putting it down, as you've been doing it, and if you just add in, um, can you do 212 on heroes, please? Well, so, yeah, um... Chat, if you're wondering what 212 means, I'm asking for 212 on heroes. That basically means I'm asking for two infantry heroes, one range hero, and two cavalry heroes. And I'm going to do the same. I'm going to do two imp, one cav, 
So two in for one range, two cap. Funny thing is, uh, we've done some testing last night, actually. It turns out that when you're doing like a 4-2-4 four, four variant, actually you can defend better if you put your two range heroes in instead of two two infantry heroes. If you go 1-2-2 two, two on a 4-2-4 four, four variant, it actually works out nice. You're almost countering with heroes. But that's a whole different conversation I'm not getting into in this video. But it's just some hero counters we were working on last night. Um, okay, so let's have a look at this. So let's take a peek at East Camp. So this time we've got heroes in here now. All right. Okay, here they come. So we've got Watcher, we've got Berserker, we've got um, we've got we've got Law Weaver and uh, Snow Storm Fox as the Cavs, and we've got Dream Witch coming in for the range hero. Okay, so we're gonna do the same thing, the same testing as before. So let's delete these reports. Bye bye. We're gonna get fresh reports in there. And this is, again is going to be the 424 on 424 on 424 test. So let's go. Make sure you're in Fury, bro. Oh, yeah. Hang on. 424. There's our 10,000 troops. We're going to put our familiars in. We're going to do the cookie cutter set, first of all. So we're going to go. Someone wants to snipe you. What, with no leader in you? Nah. Good luck with that. Well, I don't have T2, so I hope they don't do it to me. <laughs> yeah, no, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone rallies you one on this account, they're going to get clapped. Um, okay, so let's go Cav in range. And then, again, this is just the standard way. I mean, I know you, you guys don't do the range of this here, but I'm just doing like for like. Okay. No, no, no. That, not that first. Uh, what am I doing? Oh yeah, bunny. Okay. There you go. So like for like 424 with heroes. Let's have a look and see what the result looks like. And I'm using the Black Queen because he's using it too. No, I'm not using leads. We're just using heroes. And we lose. So like for like, we lost. Let's have a look at this. That's the same familiars. The same troops, range foul, and we lost. That's interesting. Okay. Yeah, it's the same familiars and everything. Rufians, you're a beast. Okay. Oh, I didn't have the heroes. Oh, I'm a fucking goon. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god man put pull your cap <laughs> put your cam back down again but it's oh man you know what man i'm just gonna give up doing this and just i just got it's just it's just so just, just put put the same heroes i got then it's definitely like for like i'm gonna i'm gonna put your camp out oh my god man i'm looking I'm like why did i lose by so much i didn't put my heroes in I'm um, forgetting the familiars to put in. Can't get that coffee. I need a coffee, bro. I tell you, I need a coffee. I do too. Oh my it, god, I'm dying for a coffee. What is a Blackwing Griffin? Oh my god, I don't even know, man. Black, uh, Blackwing Griffin. No, Blackwing Gog, Bon Griffin Bunny. Yeah, and then I'm ordering. Heroes. I know what I'm ordering McDonald's, man. It's it's gonna happen in a minute. I'm gonna order McDonald's in a minute. Really? You got to pick on Bear, huh? Now, bear's not here. Bear's not here. <laughs> Come on. Wake up. <laughs> okay, so you pop that camp down. Put your heroes in. Uh, you can tell someone hasn't had breakfast this morning, can't you? My brain cells are just not, not, not tuned in today. I'm having a bit of a slow day today. All right. Now use the same heroes I got, too. I will use the same heroes you've got. Let's have a look. Okay, there they are. Beautiful. Okay. Attack. 4,000. 2,000. If I'd done everything perfect all the time, it'd be boring. You guys like it when I mess up because it gives you something to laugh at. So, you know, enjoy the entertainment. That's all I can say. <laughs> All right, okay, there we go. Boom, boom, boom. There's the cookie cutter set. Look, we're going straight into it now. And then I need to go for... Um, 
Oh, what, who did he use again? He used Watcher and Berserker, didn't he? Yep, Lord yeah. Weaver. Do I want to do this on... I'm just kind of... Oh, you know what? It doesn't matter if we show the heroes, does it? I, I, I guess it... Okay, hang on. Uh, we're going to go range heroes. We're going to go for Dream Witch. And then Cav heroes. I'm not using the 11Ks. Don't even get me started on the 11Ks. I ain't using them. People are like, use the 11Ks. No. Okay. There it is. Okay, great. So we've got the... We've got the heroes you've got. Okay, like for like. Great. Now let's march this. And we lost again. You know why, though, right? Wow, that's really close. Why? My range stats are lower than Kraken's. Ah, so because your range is dying first, you're winning. Okay, I got you. I got you. Yeah, that's... Interesting. Interesting, okay. Look, that's fine, though. I don't care if I lost. That's fine. I just want to do another hit now with the Jade Worm. Right, put that camp out again, bro. Don't mention that hero's name in my stream. Alright. Um... So Blackwing... Hey Tabs, how you doing? Welcome to the stream, Tabs. No, I'm not advertising anything, just seem. Um, and you're putting heroes in? Yeah, same as before. But this time I'm going to switch out. I'm going to switch out Bunny for the uh, worm. Uh, who do I have for a range hero? Hi, Minecraft gamers. How you doing? I'm doing good. Just stressing out with testing this Jade Worm. So far, I'm not, uh, I've, I'm, <laughs> I started off the stream excited for Jade Worm, and now I'm just like, well, it feels like it just feels like another wall familiar. But we're, we're trying to work it out. Um, okay, let's have a look. Yeah, all right, perfect. Thank you. All right, hang on a minute. I've got someone who's going to tell me how I'm doing it all wrong. Give me two seconds, bro. Um, you're testing wrong. When you compare tier five pay to play fans, with Worm or Dryder, you are forgetting the fact that the pay-to-play fam's damage is based on one's attack stats, while the Worm aren't based on stats. Okay, I just want you to know, Ravi, that it doesn't matter whether I'm testing with 10% attack, 50% attack, 100% attack, 500% attack, 1,000 attack, a million attack, 100 billion attack, 150 trillion, 460 billion, 750 million, 960,000. You get the point. It doesn't matter whether or how much attack I do. All that does is increase the amount that die and the amount that survive. It's the same result. It's just on a bigger, bigger scale because you're increasing attack. It doesn't matter how much attack you add. It's just they're going to be the same result. Okay. The same result. Whether you use 100 troops versus 100 troops or 10,000 troops versus 10,000 troops or 10 million troops versus 10 million troops or 100 million troops versus 100 million troops. It's just numbers are getting bigger. Doesn't matter if the attack gets bigger or the numbers get bigger, you're getting the same result. So that's why um, it doesn't matter about the attack or the gear or the stats on the gear. It don't matter. Now, the HP, for example, may come into it a little bit, but I mean, there's only so much testing you can do. You can't get it 100% on the testing. You can get pretty much close to it, but obviously things are different depending on who you're attacking he's got more hp than you that's a variant he's got more attack than you that's a variant you can't it's hard to test for those variants but we're basically getting a rough idea if it's actually worth or not and that's the best we can do we get a, that's the best we can do is get a rough idea of if it's going to work if it's if it's going to work well or not in certain situations there you go Thank you. I'm sorry. You just, sorry. It's just, it's just no. It's, it's, I don't. I'm, I'm not. I'm, I want you to know, chat. I'm not angry. I'm not pissed off. I'm not. I'm not in a mood. It's just that people come in and flap their gums, and 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 they know best. But just chill, man. It's all good. Honestly, 
I wouldn't be wasting my, I wouldn't waste my time doing this if I didn't know what I was doing. I, I know what I'm doing. We're just tweaking here. We're tweaking things. We're working things out, guys. All right. We good. <laughs> we good. We good. We good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Of course, Mortal Kraken's base might is high, attack is higher. Absolutely. Yeah. Refresh your fury, Corinthians. Um. Thank it's you. On. It's, on. it's on. Okay. Cool. So just relax. Okay. What we got here? Sorry, lost bro. What's doing? What was I doing? Okay, I'm testing with heroes. This time I'm taking out the, the, the bunny and I'm putting in Jade. Right, I got it. I know what I'm doing. Right. I know what I'm doing. Attack. 4,000. 2,000. 4,000. Right, here we go. Millions. We're going to go with what I believe could be the new meta. I'm, I kind of... Want it to, I hope it is. Here it is. Boom, 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 boom. And that. That's what I think the new meta is going to be. We'll see. We're taking out the bunny. That's the only difference between the previous hit and this hit. Bunny's out. Jade Worm's in. Confirm. Heroes going in. We're going to go with the uh, Watcher. We're going to go with the Berserker. We need to go find Dream Witch. Where's Dream Witch gone? There she is. Dream Witch. And oh, yeah. we're going to go with that and that there we go there's our heroes all right great so we've got watcher we've got inf inf we've got yeah lovely that's the same as you've got smashing and here we go we lost okay fine that's okay how much did we lose by three five oh five three two four three Okay, so we lost five, six, seven, about 500, 250 less troops, 270 less troops, but damage output dropped to three, two, four from three, three, six. <sighs> Didn't really. This Jade Worm is just, uh, it, hmm. Oh, wait, wait, I got someone else is telling me I'm testing wrong. Give me two seconds. Uh, Prince, you're testing wrong. Okay. Uh, you can't have 100 troops versus 100 troops because it's too little and it'll mess up the stats. If the house eat vegetables, then who is going to throw out the computer? What? I got to reboot. My game just totally glitched out. I can't even see my own castle or yours on the map. All right, mate. Sorry, if the if if the horse eats vegetables, then who's <laughs> going to throw out the computer? <laughs> what the f what the hell are you going on about? Oh my god! <laughs> he needs to uh, he needs to share what this, he's This taking. guy is just trolling me, man. This guy is just trolling me. <laughs> uh, this guy is just full on trolling me. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> Jesus Christ okay guys i'm 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 coming to the conclusion here i'm coming to a very quick conclusion on this um my conclusion is quite simple my conclusion is quite simple i think are you ready for conclusion time because i feel like it's time for conclusion we've done a lot of tests a lot of camp tests i've, I've seen more camp tests in the last hour and a half than i want to see for the rest of the week or the year even but I think I've got enough information now to kind of come up with a little bit of a conclusion. Okay. So my conclusion for all this is this, the way this skill, okay. I just need a minute to, I need a minute to just get this out. Okay. It's in my head. I need to get it out. Okay. The way, the way this skill operates is very similar to the, the hell rider in the, and what I mean by that is it doesn't increase your damage. It doesn't make you do any more damage. You, you're not going to get more damage out of your hit. Okay. But what it is going to do is it is going to reduce the amount of damage you take, which means your losses potentially on a wonder hit are going to be less. And that has been shown every time I put this Jade Worm into the march, we had, we actually end up losing a little bit less troops. Great. Um, however, we don't lose less to the point where it changes the outcome of the battle. If I get countered, I'm still going to lose. 
if I hit like for like, I still can potentially lose as well. Um, you know, a lot of it comes down to the stats of the, the range attack, the person that's hitting compared to like the range attack I've got. You know what I mean? It, it, yeah, Corinthians has got less range attack on his march, so he's or less range stats in general. So his range died first. There was a retarget, and he ended up winning the match because of that. So it's weird how that works, right? But um, this doesn't actually game. This, it, it doesn't game change as far as wonders are concerned. It's not. You don't put this in and then become invincible. Um, it it really doesn't seem to have the effect that i was expecting especially when you consider you have to take out one of your level five familiars to make this work you have to take out something to put this in you can't take griffin out because if you take griffin out you lose way too much damage output if you take out the level five familiar the, the four you know one of the level five familiars again you you lose a lot of damage output so it's very difficult to find a place for this unless there was a sixth slot. Unless IGG is going to bring another research tree out with a sixth slot, I have trouble. I have trouble justifying removing one of the familiars we currently use to put this in. With that being said, on a spear march, the shield familiar performs better. The griffin performs better, and you certainly don't want to take out your pack fives. Or your stacking familiar because your damage output becomes too low on a spear march it's all about damage 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 you want to cause as much damage as possible when you hit and reducing that damage output just isn't viable for a spear march so the only thing i can really th feel feel think on the back well the only thing that comes to mind to be to be perfectly honest with you with regards to this familiar is i believe it could be good for a wall familiar four percent is quite low uh, IgG clearly want this familiar proccing fairly soon and I think if you were to have this on your wall in your castle where you have a higher troop count than what's hitting you so for example if you've got a castle with say 25 30 million troops and you get hit with a rally you know reducing the amount of damage you take by nine percent is pretty good that's actually pretty that's pretty pog that's gonna make you lose way less troops when you get rallied it seems like another and it's called divine you didn't did you notice that guys it's called divine fire really interesting that they call this divine fire when they've just brought out an update called divine troops um which helps you basically not get zeroed you know you lose all your troops within a few days you've got most of them back again because of the divine troops that igg just brought in this feels like a follow-on from that divine update and is another way for IGG to let make people have less losses when they get attacked. Get attacked. So, do I feel like this is for wonders? My answer is no. It's, I don't believe it is for wonders. Do I think this is better to put in wonder marches than what we currently got? No, I don't at all. Um, do I think it's really good for your wall? Yes. Do I think IGG are bringing out updates at the moment to help defenders? Yes. Is this going to help rally traps? Yes. If rally traps have this on the wall, they're going to be much harder to break down. So it seems like at the moment, IGG's focus is on the defense right now. But not for wonders. This is not a wonder familiar. Based on the testing we've done, it doesn't really benefit you at all much on wonders, to be honest. Now, if this increased attack, if, if this thing... If this thing reduced the damage you took by 9% and increased the attack you done by 9% at the same time, it would be insane. Like, it would be awesome for Wonders because you're increasing your attack. You don't lose that attack damage when you put it in. But you'd lose so much attack when you switch this out for something, it doesn't become viable. This belongs on the wall. This is where, this is where it goes, guys. It goes on your wall. So if you were going to set up your wall, let's take Lightweaver. Let's take Lightweaver out the shelter. If I was going to set up Kraken's wall for him right now. I can't remember the leader. Oh, yeah, of course I can't. Uh, he's got range. He's got an infantry hero. Like, I wouldn't have an infantry hero there. I would probably have. Well, I mean, I would have Dark Magister, of course. Where is he? Where's the where's, 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 where's DM? Where's DM? 
Oh, he's a range hero, isn't he? Hang on. Hang on. Okay. Dark Magister. So, Imp. Range. 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 Cav. I guess. I mean, I, I would do that. That would be my wall, to be honest with you. I know it's like, he's a range hero, isn't he? So, it's like two range heroes, two infantry heroes, and a Cav. Yeah, that's fine. So, that, that's basically how I would set my wall up. If, uh, if for that... And then the actual familiars, when it comes to the familiars in the wall, I mean, these new ones are great. Like these ones, these ones are great for your wall. They proc pretty quickly in 5%. Let's say Kraken was really, let's just say for example, Kraken was only gonna take defenses in info range. Well, I mean, the first familiar you put on the wall is Divine Fire. Remember, remember, I remember up to now, we haven't had pack five fams for defense. Pack five fams have all been for attack. So it makes sense that IGG are bringing out pack five fans for defense, I guess. We've already got the attack fans. Now we get the defense fans. So Divine Fire. And then I would probably go with uh, Shaman's Blessing. I'd go with Spirit Sacrifice. You know what? You know what? I'd go Screw it. If you're going to take a cat, take it, take a hit in Cav, put Rhino in as well. And the Helldrider. Boom. There, look at that. Now that's a wall. That's a wall right there, boys. <laughs> because Helldrider, I mean, I still don't think this is great for all wonders either. I saw people using it at Emperor, but I'm not I'm not I'm not sold on it either for, for wonders, to be honest. Um Helldrider has has a couple of moments where it can work well in Wonders, but it's very situational. I think it's better on the wall, to be honest, at 7%. You might as well leave it on your wall. Um and Well, I think if you're a five piece amp, it, it makes a difference. Too. Maybe. But like I said, like I said earlier on, like I said earlier on, with this Helldrider thing, it, it freezes one of the squads. If you've got a Spear March coming in, all of the army is in four squads, which means if you freeze one of the squads, you're freezing up a quarter of the army. Whereas if you're in Wonders, the, the, it's split across a comp, it's split between 12 squads. So you freeze one squad, it's not going to have nowhere near as much effect. So it's much more better for a defense if you've got Blasts coming in. Because you'll freeze up a quarter of the whole blast with just by, for 11 seconds. That's insane. So that there, I think, is the is the is the this this right here. I think is the new meta OP pog insane wall for defense. I think that's the wall right there, guys. If you go up against someone with wall like this, maybe reconsider because that wall is insane. So that right there, guys, I think is is. I, I do think I do fight I, I gotta say guys I do feel like these these familiars that have come out these pack fives this is where they live they live on your wall wall trap coming back I don't know about wall trap but this certainly benefits rally traps man that from that worm familiar is gonna be badass badass for a for a for a for a defense if you imagine if you imagine having like 30 million troops in your castle and then that thing procs and reduces the damage you're taking by 9%. That's insane, dude. That's crazy. Like, that's actually going to make you take way less losses. We could even test that shit out right now if you want to test it. Kraken's wall is a divine wall. Indeed. Indeed it is. I'll leave it like that. Yo, Corinthians, can we do one more test? Sure, what's up? Are you taking a pee? No, I'm getting water. Oh, shit. I, was, I thought you were pissing on my stream for a second. Then I was like, holy shit. This guy's taking no, a pee. Water. The reason I say that, chat, is because if we're in an R4 call, sometimes Corinthians does take us into the toilet with him and he pees while we're on the R4 call. So I'm just letting you know that's what he does. And I was like, oh, my God, you're not peeing on my stream. There's no way. Um, Just like you look into Morbid's eyes, man. Yeah, exactly. Uh, Jay, Jake, absolutely correct. Jade. Jade is good for 30 million troops because 4% is 1.2. Exactly. You get to 1.2 million troops, bang, your damage is redu reduced. You ain't taking much more than that. Um, okay. <laughs> All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a very simple test here. We're going to do a simple test to see how good the Jade Worm is on defense. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put my castle comp on the floor in, ra in range foul. In fact, I'm not even going to go range foul. I'm going to make it even awkward. I'm going to go range wedge because that's a good formation to defend him, right? And I'm going to put my castle comp down. My castle comp is going to be 100th 
thousand troops. Or should I do it like Doctor Evil? One one hundred thousand troops. Yeah, it's gonna be a hundred thousand troops comp. So we're gonna make our comp. We're gonna make our defense comp, and our defense comp is gonna be a little something like this. It's gonna go. For, we're gonna go thirty. We'll go thirty. No, we'll go forty. Forty thousand tier two inf. So tier two range. That's gonna be our. We'll go forty thousand. We're gonna go for a two two. We'll go for a four four two. There you go. That's that's basically a two front line castle setup. So there is our defense. A hundred thousand troops. We're gonna put. Oh, I, I didn't. I also didn't put no familiars or heroes on, which is kind of stupid. But let's, let's just try this out. I got. I got to try this out. So 40,000. 40, 40, 40, and twenty thousand. There's a hundred thousand troops. Familiars. I'm gonna go with what some people wouldn't use prior to using this, using the new ones. So let's go for what do people put on their walls? I guess some people would use pack five fams, right? So they would put pack five fams on. So pack five fams as defensive familiars. Okay, we could try that. Um, and then some people go for like the what is it called, like Hearty Feast and Aquarius. In fact, that, that, this is quite heavy pay to play. Let's go for more. Well, I guess if you've got Jade Worm, you are pay to play, so it doesn't really matter. So let's just go with the pay to play stuff. So there you go. So that's basically like a like a like a general yeah general wall setup like that. Yeah. Okay. Now we're gonna put our heroes in as well. Um. Oh, my leader. No, no, not my leader. No, no, no. Uh, we're gonna go with Berserker. Um. Berserker Watcher. Um, that, that, and I need Songstress. There she is. I do. There you go. That's a good. That's, that's that's. I'm pretty sure you guys would agree. That's a good wall lineup. Okay. So there we go. That's like a standard test. Now, if I've got a hundred thousand troops, I want you to send a infantry blast at me with all of your heroes. No, no leader. All of your he infantry heroes. Uh, familiars and the amount of troops I want you to send in infantry phalanx. Okay, make sure it's an infantry phalanx. I want you to send. Mm, how many should I get him to send? 10,000? 10, yeah, because then the comp is 10 times the amount of troops. So, yeah, because that would. If, if a normal rally goes in at 2.3, 10 times that would be 23 million troops. So, I think 10,000 is about right. Yeah. 10k. Right, there you go, Corinthians. 10,000 10, tier 2 infantry. One second here. You just hit 2.5 billion kills. Let's go. Congratulations, Taco. Um, yeah, so 10,000 tier 2 infantry in infantry foul with your infantry heroes and your infantry familiars. That gives us a good idea, roughly, of what it'd be like to hit a castle. Here he comes. I don't think he's going to get a walk back. No. Okay. <laughs> so how much damage did he do? I don't even think he procced my familiars. That's like 2.9%. We're going to have to increase the uh, amount of troops that come in. We're going to have to increase the, the amount of troops that come in because that's 2.9%. That's not even 7%. That's not even 4%. Oh, it's difficult, isn't it, when you ain't got all the stats on and stuff. Send 100 versus 100. Yeah, but then it's not identical for a castle here, is it? Because on a castle rally, you're not sending 30 million into 30 million. You're sending... You're sending... 2.375 million into like 30 million. Do you know what I mean? So I'm, it's like 15 times the amount of troops. They, they didn't proc. There's no way they proc. Yeah, we've already done that kind of thing. Yeah, we've already done those tests, Juicy, earlier on the stream. We've already done the like for likes. Now we're just trying to work out how good it is on the wall. I'll send 35k this time. I think we're going to have to use leader. 
How many troops do you got in there? I'm gonna get you to use your leader. A hundred thousand. I'm I'm not gonna use uh, a leader. I'm not gonna use a leader. I'm gonna get you to use a leader. Okay. Let me just I'll... let me come out of this. My my familiars didn't proc. That's all your. Oh, my choir is procced and my my hearty feast my my hearty feast proc. But nothing else procced. <laughs> I won't send the leader. You will, so you'll have a, you'll have your stats. You'll have your stats. Um, so that's what we're gonna do. He will. No, no one's gonna snipe his lead. He will. He will. He. I will put a camp down without lead, leaderless, and he will send a leader with leader march, so we can see if they found out how the familiars perform. Okay. So again, we're gonna go forty thousand. 40,000 20,000 and then uh, the standard setup which is that that and that and then this and this and then heroes we're going to go with Berserker Watcher um, Songstress um that and that there you go all right cool right sweet i'll put this down right send me ten thousand ten thousand infantry again but this time when you put your gear on your leader uh and your infantry gear and everything like all geared up with all your extra attack stats and whatnot the Corinthians Infantry Blast, ladies and gentlemen. It's uh, pretty gnarly. Hit my uh, hit my solo trap with it. I capped him, but he done a shit ton of damage. I think I made a video about that and posted it, actually. We're just waiting for the... Yeah. No! Somebody's locked on! Well, I'm just about to do it! Don't, don't, send, don't, send, don't send it yet. Don't send it yet. Don't send it yet. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, hang on a minute. Let me just, uh, fight troops. Oh shit, I saw a picture of the IGG servers. Let me go back here very quickly. <laughs> Give me two seconds while I look back in. Hang on. Just saw my secret picture of the IGG servers there while I was, uh, <laughs> just doing this. So Give me a second while I look back in, guys. Hold on. We're almost done anyway. Uh, shit. Hang on a minute. Oh god, I can't remember what the password is. Hang on. It's cracking. Got a big pee pee. Um, I don't know. His Facebook, his Facebook picture isn't the picture of his pee pee. There we go. All right, let me just see if I can get in here. Right, hopefully I don't get locked out again. All right, okay. There we go. All right. Hang on, a minute. hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Game screen. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Go. Let's get this done. There's the infantry blast, ladies and gents. Pretty, pretty, pretty gnarly. Let's get this done quickly. Go, 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 go. I'm capped, but you capped me. What? Oh, did you hit it? Yeah. Sweet. I right, listen you. Okay, let me check the, let me check the report out. Okay, that's that's still not going to proc the familiars. Okay, we need to load the troops. Okay, we need we need you need to you need to, you need to send more. You need to send more. Send twenty thousand. Fuck it, just send twenty thousand. It's not enough to proc the familiars. It's so annoying. Okay, for God's sake. Okay. Okay, 40... 80,000... No, not 80,000. 40,000... 40,000... 20,000... Um... That, that, that... This and this... Um... Heroes. This, 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 
and this and this okay great go right same thing but here with um here with 20 here with 20 20 000. and fury fury oh, you get you get fury when you, i don't need fury i don't need fury i'm good yeah we're gonna do one to five ratio absolutely kents Twenty thousand infantry blast let's go don't forget to be gear on gear 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 yep got it all right Whew. and i lost great that's perfect i lost there we go now the familiars are proking okay he walked away for 36 holy shit nice walk back corinthians <laughs> <laughs> okay so there he is there he, he had a siege walk back he got a buff oh perfect that's lovely we're gonna do exactly the same thing now okay that is with the standard familiars that's him going in with his inf blast that's me rocking the standard wall familiars now we're gonna change it up we're gonna change 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 change, change it up here we go get re remove that camp bro uh, before someone steals you before someone steals your leader Oh, quick, someone's marching in. Oh, no, never mind. It's all right, it's okay. <laughs> trying to wind him up. It never works. Okay, right, here we go. So 40, 40, 40, 20. Okay, now this time. And now we're going to see. We're going to see if I'm right on this. I like, you know, it would be nice to be right once. Come on, let me just let me be right on this. I think the new setup for Wolf Millions is going to be this, this, and then the new ones which are no not that this that and this there now that's gonna be that i think is the new wall setup we gonna see we're about to see and we're gonna put the heroes back in infantry infantry and range and cav cav here we go we're about to see boys and girls we're about to see a blind squirrel catches it out sometimes. Yeah, sometimes, bro. Okay, there it is. That's the march. That's the divine wall, which we're going to call it. Okay, dude. 20,000 infantry. Send it in, bro. Let's see if this divine wall is a thing. Don't forget to change your gear. You're a monster gear. Yep, yep. Just letting you know. Is this going to make the difference? Is is this going to show us that the, the Jade Worm is in fact a wolf familiar? He hits. Does he get capped? I lost. I lost less troops. I lost less troops. <laughs> it look. I lost less troops. I only just lost that time. Twenty thousand. Look, the, 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 this is the wall with the level, the pack fives, and that drown out thing and the HP thing. Twenty thousand nine to twenty two thousand three hundred ninety three, and then the new one with the divine wall. I've got one more test to do. Corinthians, one more test. Let me put my camp down again because I think I can put a better wall down. Hold on a sec. Just, um, let me just put, let me try one more thing. Right. 40,000, 40,000, 20,000. Right. Uh, familiars. I think if we go for this, this, I'm only ever going to take defenses in range and inf. I ain't sitting in no cav foul. foul. So, Forget the cav familiar. Let's go with infantry and range. And then let's put. I'm in range foul, so infantry. Let's put. Let's put Garg in. Let's put Garg in. Ooh, dirty Garg. Let's put Garg in. Hang on a sec. We're going to win this one, boys. Okay, let's put it back in. Here we go. Infantry. Infantry. We need the range. Where's the range? There she is. And then my two calves. Boom, boom. All right. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go ahead. In fact, what we'll do is we'll take out Storm Fox. And we'll put in... We'll put in... 
Where is she? Where's... Oh, she's a ranged fan, isn't she? I think that's Storm Fox. We'll put in Dream Witch. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two range. We'll take out Watcher. And we'll put in... Uh, there we go. Yeah. Storm Fox. Law Weaver. Okay. Yeah, the two. Okay. No, no, no. No. There we go. So let's, let's, let's go, go, go. Okay. That's going to be the lineup. Okay. Try this. Dude, do, do, do exactly the same thing. Infantry Blast. Let's go. Let's see it. Infantry Blast. Let's see if I, let's see if I successfully defend it. I think I'm going to win this one. Just a little tweak on my wall here. <laughs> Corinthians is going to walk back. Corinthians is going to walk back here. I win this. No! I lost again by how much? Oh, it's so close. 21,199 to 20,000. I actually actually took more losses. Okay, the Divine Wall works. I'm going to stick with what I said. There it is, guys, the Divine Wall. Not that, not that one. The Divine Wall. There it is. That's the one. For some reason, that, that gives you the best results. That there is your new wall. The Jade Worm is a wall familiar. There it is. That's my outcome. There it is, guys. So, guys, if you're tuning in, you're just tuning in now. First of all, smash that like button because your boy Prince is just sat here with Corinthians. So, Corinthians, can I also say thank you very much for the help, my dude? No problem. If you need to go get some sleep, you can go now, bro. Yep, yep. I'm yeah, gonna take off. I, I figured you would. No, but thank you so much for the help, though, man. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. All right, so if so Corinthians is out, Thank you so much, dude, for the help. I really do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, jumping off the call. Okay, guys, look. Let's put. Let's just. Let's just. Let's just recap. Let's just recap. Okay. Um. Jade Worm, great, great familiar. Seems to have a really good effect on uh, wall defenses. It's going to be great for rally traps. Great for solo traps. Oh my god! If you're a solo trap or a rally trap, you need this familiar. This needs to be on your shopping list for Christmas. If you do not have this familiar on your rally trap or your solo trap, get spending, boys, because you're gonna want to get your jade worm onto your traps. So and not only is it gonna be great for this familiar, but you're also gonna be able to start working on your counter boost as well, which are gonna be even better for your trap. So seriously, traps just got a massive boost. Traps became harder to, to, to kill. IgG are on the trap side at the moment. I, I, as a rally lead, I can't say I'm enjoying this much. But yeah, <laughs> it seems like um, yeah. Shout out to Corinthians, absolutely. Thank you, Clonical. It seems it's a lot. It's, yeah, it's sixteen hundred or gold orbs. It's a lot, but my goodness, if you put this on your trap, you're going to see some extremely better defenses. As far as the wonder stuff goes, very lackluster to be fair. The limit, the, the lack of, you do lose less troops. Yes, that is correct. But your lack of attack, the, the, the drop of attack you have isn't, isn't really something which I'm, I'm too happy with. For example, if you're doing like a, a march where you've got like a mixed march in there, let's say, for example, you're running the three main attack pack fives. You're running an extra bunny maybe and and that maybe for like a, an eight five seven i mean this is a nice little comp for nine five six eight five seven um you know to put jade in here would be lovely but you need to take out one of these familiars and the problem is all five of these familiars offer damage output and yes the jade worm is going to make you lose a few less troops by reducing the amount of damage you've got coming in but you're going to also be reducing the amount of damage you're doing. So ultimately, it, that's not great. Also, the other thing is it doesn't it doesn't it's not as if it's not effective to the point where it's going to help you defend against counters. Like if you get countered, you still lose. You might lose a few less troops, but ultimately you still lose, which is a similar test to what we found with the Helldrider, which is why I believe the Helldrider and the 
um, Jade Worm are both defensive familiars for your wall. The Hell Drider has shown that it does have some some um, some use uh, when you're being attacked with like 208 um, or like 055. And the only reason that it works well against those is because the troops are more consolidated into eight squads instead of the 12. Again, I'll go over to the formation screen and show you what I'm talking about. There are 12 squads on the field. Ignore Siege for a second. There are 12 squads. If you're running like a 956 or an 857, then your, your troops are more evenly spread across all those 12 squads, which means when you freeze out one of those squads for 11 seconds, you're not freezing that many troops. Whereas when someone sends you a 208, for example, they come at you with a 208 like this. Um, you can see the 208, like 80% of the troops are in those four cavalry squads. So if you freeze up one of those cavalry squads for 11 seconds, you're actually freezing up a lot of the army, which is why some people are finding that mixed for mixed wonder rallies are doing well against 208 with the hell drider in and likewise with the the, uh, the 055 because again the troops are consolidated into eight squads rather than the 12 whereas the infantry is zero on a 055 um so yeah hell drider has some very situational positive abilities in to positive outcomes in wonders jade worm though just looking at it overall I don't feel like it does. I feel like, you know, the amount of damage you lose is, is quite significant. Um, and that's also why I think it works really well. It works really well against spears, I guess. Reduces damage output. Spears are really high damage, like over 12, 1300%. The amount of damage IGG have been... It makes sense that IGG have brought these in because if you consider artifacts, for example, they brought in the artifact building. They've given attackers so much more attack stats with these artifacts they brought in with astrolite they've increased in every, all the attackers stats with astrolite with artifacts uh, the attack stats have gone through the roof and traps were struggling to deal with it defenders on like traps were struggling to deal with it rally traps getting smashed it makes sense that igg are now rebalancing the game out with new defensive familiars for defenders to attack with yeah it's going to be pay to play yeah it's going to cost you a lot of money but you know what if you can get this thing done and get onto your wall, you're going to be so much stronger as a trap. For sure, for sure. So, I want to say thank you to Kraken for opening it up and maxing it out. I mean, it, you know, I'm sure he will also want to play around with it on Wonders as well and just get his thoughts on it as well. Um, but I still am skeptical on my... I'm going to, I'm going to sign out of here now, by the way. Uh, let me go back to the wonder for him. Okay. Uh, any scout on? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to log out of here. There we go. And I'm going to log into my account. Uh, let me go ahead and just drop a message to let them know I've logged out. Um, okay, so when it comes to my account, I, I don't know guys, if I'm gonna, I'm gonna read the chat in just a second, guys. I, I, I don't, I'm nearly finished my summary. Um, I don't know if I'm going to rush in and get this unlocked as well. I don't know, guys. Because my main account, I'm not worried. About, I'm not too worried about taking a defense. If someone hits me, good luck. You know, I mean, unless they've got tons of rallies to come at me. I mean, good luck. It's, I'm not worried about a single rally. I'm happy with my wall the way it is. I've got my pack fives on it. I've got these two sitting over here chilling. My wall's pretty solid, mate. I, I don't need to worry too much about people attacking me. I got a video coming up really soon of someone countering me with some insane cavalry set and you'll see what happened. I mean, I'm not worried. My account, especially with all the boosting I've done recently with the castle stars, the artifacts and everything, like my base stats are pretty solid now. So if anyone attacks me, I mean, 
it's, it's it doesn't really do much it's pretty cool now <laughs> it's gonna take a lot to take to zero me out now anyway because of the, the base stats that i've increased but the point i'm trying to make i'm not not what the point i'm trying to make because i'm not because my account's a big rally lead account i'm not too fussed about people attacking me rally traps and stuff yeah that's gonna really benefit you I don't know if I'm going to rush in and get this just yet. I don't feel like, as with the Helldrider, I don't feel like I've seen enough to warrant me to use my, my brilliant orbs on this just yet. As a rally lead, I don't know if I want to get this yet. Because they're bringing out, they're actively bringing out familiar skills right now, guys. And I don't know what is to come. And I'm still got my eyes firmly fixed on Mecha Trojan, which is going to be a cav skill, 100% it's a cav familiar title titan which is gonna be an infantry skill as you can see it's infantry familiar and the grim reaper which is going to be range because it's a range familiar it's really ironic isn't it they've got a cav an inf and a range sitting here waiting so yeah i still feel like there's something big on the way and i feel like it's going to come in the form of mecha trojan title titan and grim reaper so i'm kind of hesitant to get hell dried this is why i like doing this testing because it tells me and it tells you if it's worthwhile opening up if you're a rally lead as a trap yes get it you need it 100 percent. but as a rally lead i don't know man this ain't gonna go in my spears it ain't gonna, and, and from what i've seen it's not gonna go in my one in my wonder marches so i'm gonna hold off i'm actually gonna hold off when i first read this this morning reduces damages inflicted by nine percent i was like holy shit that's insane this is gonna be mad in a wonder march but now i've tested it i don't quite feel the same way hmm interesting hey chat what we saying got a brief glimpse of ig's amazing servers yeah 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 uh guys the stream we are close to 250 likes are we 250 likes fantastic let's take a look we're at 231 likes let's go baby let's get that up to 250 boys let's go Thank you so much. And girls. Obviously, there's girls here too. Sit the 7% of the girls that are here, based on my analytics. Thank you for being here. <laughs> um, Star Gamble on stream, 2%. And I'm going to star scrolls at the moment. Um, if Prince drops to 1.8, he got rallied. Oh, no, I'm good, bro. I've got, I got troops. I'm all right. Um, Lol, not spending in months now. Sucks. Aren't true. I'd hold off. I'm going to hold off uh, Prime. Absolutely. Those three may upgrade the pack three stackers. Uh, maybe it could be an upgrade to the stacking familiars couldn't it or something i know that's what i'm saying they could be huge gold familiar i guess is coming maybe who knows they're gonna do it if if they do it christmas time possibly iggy possibly have you checked out the cash event is there a cash event you're talking about this you get like a bunch of random people that you have to invite I invited all of them, but none of them have played the game. So I can't get another rewards. Look at all these artifact coins. There's loads of them. You can't get them unless these random people who I don't even know come into the game and start their accounts up. That's great, isn't it? What a stupid event, man. Like, what? <laughs> uh, there's, no other, there's no other cash event in there, right? Nah. I got all of my uh, N N NFTs. I hope you guys got all your NFTs as well. I claimed all my NFTs. I finally finished all of this uh, smiley event. So I've got all of the avatars and whatnot. So that's pretty cool. Yes, us ladies are here. Hey, Tabs. I know. Yeah, well, 7% seven, seven of you, though. <laughs> Ether can get, get it. They're a big trap at 1,600 gold orbs. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. But it's worth, I think. How is your fellow progression going? Valor progression's going well. It's going okay. I mean, I haven't done much since the last stream. But give us next week, week after or something. We'll start pushing it some more. I like to take a break between doing it. I don't like doing it all in one go. There we are. The Valor's looking good, though. We're at 5 out of 14. You know, so we're close. We're close to getting the Valor to uh, Mythic. That'll be very nice when that's done. Absolutely. Those emotes are dumb. Yeah, I'm not exactly... I, you know what? It would be nice if IGG was able to make some animated emotes that actually move. You know? That actually lets you like, do something. Like, you know, you get a face that pokes a ton out. Like that, you know? Just some animated ones would be quite cool. The smiley event is terrible. The shields hurt my eyes. Yo, IGG sent a message out about the smiley event this morning. 
Wait, what did they say about the smiley event? Hang on a minute. Did I delete it? I normally do delete their messages, to be fair. No. I don't know where it's gone. They said something about, do you like how beautiful smiley shields? I was like, uh, not really. Anyway, I'm disappointed because they didn't put one on the base. Why would they not put one on the base? Very disappointing. Attack on Titan skin and I'm sorry. I know, I know right? We were talking. We had this conversation the other day in stream about what good collaborations would be good with IGG. I think the ones we came up with, which were good, was Naruto, Attack on Titan. Um, I think Pokemon as well, guys. I think. Uh, I think. Come on. I think uh, a Lord's Mobile X Pokemon would be good. I actually saw uh, another game. I can't remember what it was called. Another mobile builder game that just done a collaboration with Walking Dead. And they had all Walking Dead heroes. That's pretty cool, right? Um, I can't remember what what game it was. I was I was looking at. It might have been Monster Hunter or so, or Monster Hunter or something. I don't know. There was a, definitely another game that had that. Yeah, Pokemon would be lit. But then IGG would have to pay out their ass for those collabs, and they ain't doing that. Yeah, I can't imagine what kind of cost it would be involved in a Pokemon collaboration. Unless it was work, unless it was in the benefit of both both companies, you know. But Pokemon would be pretty sweet, pretty sick. Pokemon would never collab with Lords. You don't think so? I think it would be badass if they did. Can you imagine having like a Pikachu as a leader? I don't care what stats it's got. I would buy it. Like I don't care. I just don't care. It it could have like a hundred percent gathering speed and like four hundred percent troop load. I wouldn't give a shit. I'd be buying that hero. I don't care how much it costs. I'll be getting it. I would want Pikachu as my leader. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely, guys. 100%, 100. I mean, if they can do, yeah, if they can do a collab with Mr. Beast, they can do a collab with Pokemon. Come on now. Lord's Mobile Pokemon. Mm. Even if it was a new 11K, no, I wouldn't buy an 11K for gathering speed, bro. No, there is a limit. <laughs> okay, there is maybe a limit. It's a date, Saturday. Is it? Oh, sorry. <clears throat> He's ignoring who? I'm down. What? We need to start hounding him on Saturday. Are oh, you talking about gear check Sundays? I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So, look. I'm going to end the stream there, okay? But before I go, I just want to say, look. If I'm wrong about the Jade Worm, leave comments down below. If you feel that I'm totally wrong and it's actually really good in Wonders, leave comments down below. Let me know. As always, it's been a pleasure helping you guys out. I mean, I'm always happy to do these tester streams and see what this new stuff that IGG bring out. It's no good asking IGG directly because they just turn around and say, go test it out in game and find out. So, yeah, I mean, you know I mean, they don't tell you nothing. So we need to have this content so we can see if it's actually worth or not. And I've done plenty of testing today uh, with heroes, without heroes, with familiars, without familiars. I mean, I've done... I've done everything, so like loads today. I'm sure there's more that can be done. But, I mean, if I didn't see something exceptionally awesome off the back of today's testing, then I don't know. I don't know if we're going to see it. And just to remember, guys, when you're doing camp testing, tier 4 is the same as tier 2. Remember that. Based off, you just remember that, yeah? <laughs> IGG flat out doesn't know, yeah. I know, that, 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 they don't know how any of this stuff works. I know, right? <laughs> okay, guys, an absolute pleasure. Thank you guys for coming through. If you haven't smashed that like button, do it before you go. Thank you for the 250 likes. I'll be back at you really soon with some more content. But until then, you know how then this next bit goes. Stay safe, everyone. And of course, let me find the button. And peace out.